you love cookies. In this video. Where should I hide? Okay, I think this might be a really great spot. Molly will never find me up here. <laughs> Did you just say up here? Molly, stop listening. Well, it's not my fault. <laughs> um, yeah, a lot of ladders. A lot of ladders. <laughs> okay, um, I put my ladder in the wrong spot. Daisy, I need more than a minute. Come on, no fair. I can't make my ladder any taller than that. Ugh. Okay, the ladder's not going any taller than this, but how'd, how'd you get up there? She won't find me in 60 seconds, because if she does... Oh, Daisy, I'm ready. Holy crack of moly, it's dark in here. Um, so this looks like the school at Brookhaven, except for, um, yeah, there's... There's no desks or anything. <laughs> and the hide-and-seek god! <laughs> And today, guys, we are playing Minecraft Brookhaven Hide and Seek. That's right, guys. This is going to be so much fun. And we can't wait for you guys to see our new Minecraft videos. Yeah, this is going to be fun. Okay, um, Daisy, you're it first. What? Why am I it first? Because <laughs> I said so, and this is my video. And it's not your video. It's both of our videos. Ugh, she's such an annoying sister sometimes. Fine, I'll count. You go hide. All right, guys, I need to find a great place to hide in this Minecraft Brookhaven. And I think I know the perfect spot. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. All right, guys, I don't think she's going to find me down here. I really don't. Ready or not, Molly, here I come. I wonder where Molly could be. I know I'm going to find her because I'm better at hide and seek than she is. What? No, you're not. <laughs> of course I am. Where are you, Molly? I think we should make this game that she has 30 seconds to find me. What? That's really hard, Molly. <laughs> Wait, did she find me? No, I didn't find you. Okay, go. Dizzy has 30 seconds or I win the round. Okay, Molly, um, wait, can you give me a hint? Nope, no hints. Found you! What, already? Oh, that's so annoying. Ha <laughs> I win the round. <laughs> that was only the first round, so I'm just getting warmed up. Sure, Molly, sure. Okay, no peeking, now I'm gonna hide. Uh, Daisy, I'm only gonna count to ten. What? That's not enough time. Well, you're going to have to make it enough time. Besides, you said you're an expert at hiding in hide and seek. Where should I hide? Okay, I think this might be a really great spot. Molly will never find me up here. <laughs> Did you just say up here? Molly, stop listening. Well, it's not my fault. <laughs> Apparently, um, Daisy just gave away her hiding spot. Not really, Molly. You still have a lot of buildings, and you only have 30 seconds. Uh, I changed my mind. Let's make it 60 seconds, because... Um, 30 seconds is too short. And you actually technically got 60 seconds. Oh, wait, whatever, 60 seconds. I'm ready, Molly. Okay, guys, um, I have exactly, uh, a minute. So, let's go find Daisy. I know she said she's up here. So, I don't know where up here is, but I've got to find her. And... Oh my god, this is really hard. Daisy, we should have made a rule that you couldn't be on top of buildings. No fair. All right, guys, I'm definitely going to need a ladder. Um, yeah, a lot of ladders. A lot of ladders. Okay, um, I put my ladder in the wrong spot. Daisy, I need more than a minute. Come on, no fair. I can't make my ladder any taller than that. Ugh. My sister is terrible at Molly, you're actually breaking apart Brookhaven. What's wrong with you? I'm trying my best right now, okay? The ladder's not going any taller than this, but how'd you, how'd you get up there? Molly, just try to climb it, that's all. Whoa. Ah, I just fell down. Molly, you have literally like 10 seconds to find me. <laughs> Daisy, why do you have to be good at everything? You're so annoying sometimes. Obviously, she's not up that building, guys, because the ladder won't even go up that high. But I remember a building that has a ladder you can climb, guys. The police station. 
Are you literally uh, over 60 seconds? What? No, I'm not. No, I'm not. Ah, <laughs> found you. Well, you don't get a point for that. You're over 60 seconds. Well, you don't get a point either. Oh, yeah, yeah. My sister is such a sore loser. What? Me? No, I'm not a sore loser. Well, okay. Maybe a little. Molly, let's just try again. I'll hide somewhere else and you can give it another try, okay? Oh, I need a cookie. Time to make myself be feel better with some stress eating. Oh, mm, delicious chocolate chip cookie. Mm, so good. Molly, I'm hiding again. Oh, I need to eat more cookies. I need a lot more cookies. She's so much better at hide and seek than me. <laughs> Do you guys know what this is, April Caven? I bet Molly does it. Nah, 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 nah. Oh, great. She's hidden again, guys. And, and now I have to try to find her. Oh, this is harder than actual Brookhaven. All right, guys. I am on the hunt for Daisy. And I literally have 60 seconds to find her. Molly, I think you need more like 600 minutes to find me. La, 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 la. Because I'm just going into any random building I can find. Because I don't know. Like, I feel like we should say you can't hide inside buildings. Because that makes it like so hard to find somebody in 60 seconds. Daisy, can you give me like a little hint? Just a little one. Sure, Molly. You eat lots of cookies for me. <gasps> She's at the grocery store. All right, guys. I literally have like 20 seconds to go find my sister. And then when I find her, dun, 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 I'm going to get a point. Well, you get a half a point because you found me, Molly, but I had to give you a hint. Hint or not, Molly gets a point. Daisy has a point and Molly has a point. Finally, Molly gets to hide again. Hooray! All right, guys, this time I know exactly where I want to hide. Well, I think so. Um, But... I'm just thinking that Daisy is like so good at this. I, I hope that I can figure out a spot that she won't find me in 60 seconds. Because if she does, I might actually stand a chance at winning this game. <laughs> yeah, she's never going to find me here. Not in 60 seconds. Oh, Daisy, I'm ready. One place I think Molly would think I'd never look is the school because she doesn't really like doing schoolwork or homework. <laughs> so I think that'd be the place where she would hide and wouldn't think that I would look for you. Holy guacamole, it's dark in here. Um, so this looks like the school at Brookhaven, except for, um, yeah, there's, there's no desks or anything. <laughs> I gotta, like, light this up so I can see where I'm going. Ah, <laughs> Daisy, you're not gonna find me in 60 seconds. Molly, you got a hint. Do I at least get a hint? Um, yeah, okay. Here is your hint. Uh, uh. What? You're moaning? What? What? Are you having a bad dream? I want to eat your brains. Okay, you're a place that a zombie would hang out. I know! I know where it is! <laughs> you only have three seconds now, Daisy. And time's up! I win! I can't believe I'm beating my sister right now. This is amazing. I never beat her at hide and seek. Not even in real life. Molly, I think we should play one more round. And if you win, awesome. But if I get another point, then it's going to be a tie. We'll have to do a tiebreaker. Okay, Daisy, I'll count. And you go high. The pressure's really on, people. I gotta find an amazing hiding spot, because if I don't, my sister's actually gonna beat me at this game, and I don't want her to, so let's go see what we can find as far as a hiding spot. I, oh my god, guys. I don't even know. Daisy, I'm almost ready to come find you. Molly, give me a second already. Gosh, this is harder than regular Brookhaven, so... Guys, I'm just gonna find somewhere that I don't think she'll be able to find. But she may be able to. Ready or not, here I come. Daisy, I literally see your name. <laughs> what? 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 Daisy, um, you just lost hide and seek. <laughs> but Molly, uh, what? No, we do. I want to do over. But Daisy, I saw your name. It was like right across from me. 
All right, Daisy, you can have a do-over, but just so know that if you win, I'm actually the winner. What? Th that's not how do-overs work. Sorry, but I saw your name. It was, like, right there, right in front of me. See? Oh, yeah, yeah, I didn't think about that. Oh, I feel like such an ignoramus. I'm sorry, Daisy, just have a do-over. But you already said that if I do a do-over, you still win. Well, I mean, I am the best at Minecraft hide-and-seek that there ever was. Ha, 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 ha. my sister is so annoying. Can't believe Molly saw my name and it gave me away. Okay, um, guys, this time I really do have to up my game. I don't want Molly to beat me. La, 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 la. My name is Easy, just like the flower. Okay, I think I'm in a spot that she'll never figure out. But at least not in 60 seconds. <laughs> Ready or not, Daisy? Here I come. Ooh, wow, pretty sunset. Never give up and never surrender, cause you can do anything. If you put your mind to it, whoa, whoa, whoa. It looks like an obby up there. You can do it. Wow, Molly, you're pretty confident in yourself right now. Oh, man, it started raining. <laughs> um, guys, for some reason, I'm like stuck. Okay, there we go. <laughs> I was trying to move. Oh, my God, Daisy, I just found you again. What? Oh, three points to one. Wah, 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 wah. Guess who just won? Me, 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 me. <laughs> oh, Daisy. Just, just look at me. I am the hide and seek god. <laughs>
Yeah, now I can't get out. I totally suck. Oh, I'm stuck in the walls. All right, there we go. That was actually a really good hiding spot, Marley, I have to say. I thought so, too. If I hadn't given you such a big hint, you would have never, ever found me. Well, it's my turn now, Marley. Start counting. One, two, three. She's never going to find me. Ready or not, here I come. Okay, guys, I have not gotten a Snapchat from Daisy yet. Um, but I'm just going to look for her before I get one. Because I literally want to see if I can find her without Snapchat. Ready, do you give up? Do you need a Snapchat hint? Yeah, you can send me a Snapchat hint. Okay, here it is, guys. Let's see what it says. Daisy, that's impossible for me to see where you are. Come on. Send me an easier snap than that. Fine. Well, I sent you one. And you knew exactly where I was, basically. We gotta start making it harder and harder, but not that hard. I'm waiting for Daisy's snap to come in. While I'm waiting, I'm totally gonna just jump on this trampoline. Whee! Fun! Hopefully this is a better snap than before. Oh, Daisy, half your head is missing. W? What? Oh my god, and I only get like five seconds to look at it. Like guacamole? I have no idea where that is. W-T-E-F? Guys, would you have any idea where that is? Because, I don't know. I guess I should start looking at buildings. You see, I need a better hint than that. One more snap. Really, Molly? You stink at this game. I'm just saying, this is really hard. Guys, should, I'm going to start going in buildings. All right, here we go. I got another snap from Daisy. Oh, I think I think that's like at the grocery store or something. <laughs> Laundry mat. Maybe it's at the pet palace. I'm going to go there first. Uh, Molly, when was the last time the pets drank bottled water? <laughs> My dogs drink from the toilet bowl, so <laughs> they don't need anything fancy like bottled water. All right, guys, let's head over to the Walmart and see if we can find Daisy. <coughs> Daisy, where are you? Oh, I'm G, guys. I still have not found Daisy. Where could she possibly be? This is ridiculous. I'm so much better at hide and seek than Molly, guys. Yeah, I guess you are. Aw. Molly, do you need yet another Snapchat? Yeah. She's outside in a trash can. Okay. <laughs> well, having sisters sometimes is a bunch of trashy garbage. Molly! <laughs> Saw you, Daisy! Oh, great. I was out trying to make a Snapchat for you, and basically I got caught because you're so bad at hide and seek. You were... You got inside the machine? Oh, man, I feel like such an ignoramus. Let's see the last snap that Daisy sent me. I definitely want to see it. Oh, I keep messing up. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Molly, you have to press the... Oh, you're going to break your phone, Molly. Okay, there we go. What? Um, Daisy, that's that was also not helpful, but I just saw you jumping around. Is it my turn to hide? Um, well, okay. Yay! Finally. Start counting. One, two. Guys, I have the perfect spot. OMG, this, she's never gonna find me, like ever. Uh huh, sure, Marty. I'll never find you, I bet. Uh oh! You're not very good at hide and seek. Well, I know, but, well, it is what it is. I just do my best, people. <laughs> Guys, look where I am right now. What do you know? Here we come! I have to send Daisy my first chat Snapchat right now. <laughs> Alright, Daisy, here you go. You in the school, Molly! <laughs> That's what you think. Well, I guess I could just take a nap right here since my sister is never gonna find me. Guys, I just wanna see when she runs by me, cause it's probably gonna be um, one eternity before she actually figures this out. Molly, I need another hint, please. Okay, Daisy Jeepers. 
<laughs> Guess I'm not the only one that doesn't know how to play hide and seek. Ah, uh, very good. What? I'm great at hide and seek. I'm just, well, I'm good at the hiding, not so much the seeking. One minute, 37 seconds later. Oh, you gave it away, Molly. That one was much too easy. No, you can't catch me. <laughs> Molly, I'm gonna catch you. No, you're not. No, you're not. No, you're not. I'm gonna make it back to the safe zone. What? You just made that world up. <laughs> you ran me over with the ambulance. Now I caught you, Molly. Should I take you to the Looney Tunes bin? What? To the Looney Tunes bin? <laughs> oh, congratulations, Daisy. You totally crashed the ambulance. <laughs> well, I still caught you. Molly. Nope, not yet. Still running for my life. Back to the safe zone. Wait, where is the safe zone? I can't remember where the safe zone even is. Oh my gosh, Molly. Oh no, she spawned another car. Guys, hurry quick on top of the waterfall. <laughs> you can't pick me up. No! Get away from me. <laughs> Molly, I'm going to get you. No, you're not. I'm almost to the safe zone. You're going to lose. You're going to lose, Daisy. You're trying to pick me up in the car. Oh my god, Daisy. Yay, I made it. I'm still gonna hide again, Molly. Now count already. Okay, fine. Ready or not, Daisy, here I come. Are you gonna send me a Snapchat or what? If not, I'm gonna go in here and um, do some laundry, eat a snack. Oh, yeah, yeah, Molly, I was sending it to you. Give me a second. Daisy, you look dead. What is going on? Um, I don't know where you are, but it's definitely outside, and you definitely look like you are D-E-A-D -E dead. Maybe she's, like, lounging in the park or something, guys. Oh, my God. If you guys see her, and I don't, I really am going to feel pretty ignoramus. <laughs> she's wearing a bright pink shirt. I feel like she can't be that hard to find. Maybe she's on Muscle Beach, but no... The grass was green underneath her, so... Oh, man, this is gonna be harder than I thought. Do you need another snap, Molly? Yes, I need another snap. Always need another snap. She could literally be hiding anywhere in this town. Where is my sister, Daisy? Here's the next Snapchat, guys. Let's see where she is. I don't know what building that is. Um, okay. Guys, I have to find this building that looks like that. I don't know which one it is, but I'm gonna try to find it. Oh, wait, I think I see it, guys. I think I see it. Hmm. It definitely looks like it's going up a hill. Ha! <laughs> Bally, I feel like you're never gonna find it. Oh, thanks for the vote of confidence, Daisy. Wait, why is there a police car right there? Is Daisy in that? Is she gonna try to run me over again? <laughs> Guys, maybe she's like laying in these bushes right here. Oh my god, this is so hard to find my sister. I'm going into the prison. <laughs> That's where you belong, Daisy, for, for, I don't know, for being so good at this game. It's driving me crazy. Okay, I have I have a plan, guys. I have a plan. Does it include losing? Because you're pretty good at that. Oh, uh oh. Okay, DC, whatever you say. Well, you are, Molly. Just saying. Nah. All right. Um, I'm going to the top of town. The reason why I'm doing this is because I feel like I can see all the buildings where my sister is a little bit better. Okay, I have no idea, Daisy. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, no. That was just a stab light. I literally thought that was my sister. Oh, my God. What is wrong with me right now? Okay, Daisy. You forever win. You're the best at this game ever. Send me another Snapchat, please, and let me know. Where are you? All right, just send me another snap. Okay, it's a brown building. What? Where am I? Oh, is this the building? No, I don't think that's a building. I don't know where to go right now. But I gotta find my sister somehow. I didn't ask you for another snap. I'm still trying to figure it out. 
Oh, just look at it, Molly. Well, you took me. <laughs> Running by you. Wait a minute. Molly, you're never gonna find me. What is wrong with you right now? Okay, I'm a little terrible hide and seek. Ah. One eternity later. Wait a minute, guys. This looks like the front of the building that she sent me. <laughs> there you go, duh. Okay, where could she be, guys? It looked like she was outside. I mean, you literally could hide in any of these shrubs anywhere and not get caught ever. We should play this with Brookie and all of our friends, I think. I think we should too, Molly. Oh my god. I'm never gonna find her! Wait, there's some grass back here. Maybe she's hiding there. It looked like she was in grass. It sort of looked like she was in the cemetery too. Um, I don't know, but I just found my next hiding spot. Don't tell Daisy though. Five minutes later. Oh, this is so annoying and I can't find my, ouch. Oh, I'm I knew she was in one of these bushes. That was the best hiding place ever. That was so hard to find you, Daisy. <laughs> you are so lost. It was great. You're terrible with directions. Okay, fine, go count. It's my turn. <coughs> yeah, you think you're so smart? You think you're so great at this? Well, compared to you, Molly, yes. All right, guys. I found my next hiding spot. She's not going to even know what hit her right now. Watch Ooh. this. Okay, Daisy, ready. Look at me, guys. Oh, my God. That is so crazy. Can you find me, Daisy? I don't think. I'll find you, Molly, if it's the last thing I do. Okay, send me a Snapchat, though. Yeah, she always needs that Snapchat. Okay, here you go. <laughs> I'm not going to make this last one easy on you, Daisy. I want to see if this video can be three hours long on YouTube while you find me. Uh-oh. Make it hard on you like you've made them hard on me. Oh, my gosh, guys. I actually do see Daisy right now. You guys see her? She's like, nah, she's clueless. Never give up and never surrender. I'm gonna find Molly. Daisy, did you cheat on this round? Did you see where I wa was going or something? Well, uh, Daisy, you cheated. I get to go again. Not fair. <coughs> Molly, you cry like a baby where you are. <coughs> you wouldn't have known where I was right away. That's okay. That's okay, Daisy. I'm gonna pick an even better spot this time and you will never find me. Not ever, not ever, not ever. <laughs> guys, I can't even find me right here. Can you guys see where I am? Well, it's really hard to show you guys, but you guys can see, right? <laughs> Ready or not, here I come. You can see where Daisy is on the map right now. Let's see if she can find me. I probably won't even need Snapchat. Uh -huh, sure you will. Let's see if I can even do a Snapchat right now, guys. <laughs> yeah, that's a perfect one. Here you go, Daisy. Oh my gosh, guys, I'm like between worlds right now. What? You're not even in the game? Uh oh! I'm not in the game. It's just, nah. It's a little glitchy, but that's good for me and bad for you. Oh my god, guys. What is going on? I can't get, okay, I can't get out now. Okay, there we go. One hour later. Guys, there's Daisy way down there. She still has absolutely no clue where I am. <laughs> <laughs> not so easy to play hide and seek with me now, is it? Molly, can I have another hand, please? You actually did hide really good this time. Okay, guys, she's asking for another Snapchat hint. So, what should I give her? <laughs> 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 okay, this is fun. 
There you go, Daisy. Good luck. I can't even see where I am. There we go. <laughs> Where's Daisy? Oh, there she is, guys. She's running through town right now, trying to figure it out, and she cannot. Guys, I hope you can go get a snack from your kitchen. Settle into your favorite cozy spot because it's gonna take Daisy about 300 years wow. to find where I am right now. <laughs> all right, let's send her another Snapchat. Your Snapchat's not useful, Molly. Well, I can't help you. I don't know what to say. <laughs> Guys, look at that one. <laughs> Best spot ever. How about this one, guys? Look at this Snapchat. I'm gonna try it now. <laughs> oh, I gotta turn it around. Still nothing. Where am I? I'm like, I disappeared. Well, there I am. <laughs> Here you go, Daisy. <laughs> oh, it's getting dark. Daisy, this took you so long, it's dark out. But this is really hard. Where are you, Molly? <laughs> Wouldn't you like to know, Daisy? Sometimes it's hard for me to like get an overhead viewpoint so I can show you guys. Okay, guys, my sister really needs help. So what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna text her a clue right now. And let's see what she... What? Um, <laughs> what she says. Oh man, that cost so much money. Come on. Oh, did it not work? Where do... Sent it! Where do trolls live? What do you mean by that? I mean, where do trolls live, Daisy? Molly, I think I know where you are! Good luck to you! <laughs> she, look, she's, she's circling with a helicopter, guys! Seriously, my sister took this very, very, very personally that she could not win this last round of hide and seek with me. I finally figured it out! Molly's in here or something. <laughs> <laughs> Molly, where are you? <laughs> Found you! <laughs> wow, Molly, that was an amazing spot. Yeah, no, I can't get out of it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, M. G. <laughs> I thought I was never gonna find you again, Molly. Yeah, I thought so too. Hey, can you pick me up? I feel like a little bit tired. <laughs> oh, there, there, baby Molly. Did you get very tired when you were waiting for me to find you under the bridge, you little troll baby? <laughs> Wait, we're going in the helicopter? How the hell? This seems like a bad idea. You can't hold a baby and drive a helicopter. Daisy, seriously, this seems like a bad idea. It's a fine idea, Molly. How about a little helicopter ride home? Hey guys, thanks so much for watching us play hide and seek Snapchat version. We'll see you in my next video. Bye. I think this shirt sums up how I feel about homework perfectly. <laughs> I'm wearing it to school today. Totally. La 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 Molly, you are so loud in the morning. I swear. I just woke up and you're like blah 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 blah. Yeah, that's what you sound like all day with me. Blah 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 blah. Do your homework. Don't fart in class. Molly, why you gotta be such an annoying sister? I'm going over here to eat my breakfast. Girls, could there just be one morning before school where you get along? No, probably not. Yeah, if Daisy could stop being so annoying. Ugh, girls. Hey, Mom, I know what would make us in a great mood. Okay, Molly, what is it? Anything at this point. Um, wait, what's this for breakfast? Ah, I dropped it on the floor. Oh, Mom, can you make me something else? I just dropped my food on the floor. Ugh, Molly. Yes, okay. Um, I was wondering, Mom, could we have a sleepover? I don't know, Molly. You got detention this week. No, but I did my homework last night. Molly, did you really? You're wearing a shirt that says, I don't like homework. Um, I mostly did it. 
Okay, <laughs> now I have my food. Didn't it look like I was flying across the room? Oh! <laughs> There's my food from earlier. I could eat it like a dog. Yum, 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 yum. Oh, yes. Molly, get in your chair and eat like a normal human being, please. Uh, no promise. Anyway, just because my shirt says I don't like homework doesn't mean I didn't do it. Collection, we didn't have any homework last night. Exactly. So I technically didn't not do my homework. Ay, ay, ay. I'm taking out the trash. Well, Mom, can we please have a sleepover, please? Whoa, you're actually on my side about this, Daisy? Because I wanted a sleepover. Okay, a small sleepover. One or two friends. Yay! Okay, Mom, I'm taking this to go, okay? All right, have a great day. Thanks, Mom. Brookie, look! We got to school at the same exact time. Whoa, crazy. Is it for BFFs or something? <laughs> I just teleported here because, you know, Roblox and stuff. Whoa, wouldn't it be cool if you could teleport to school in real life? And also maybe teleport out of school when you didn't do your homework. Or you just really want to go to Starbucks and get something delicious. Uh, okay, Molly, whatever you say. No, for real. If you could teleport in real life, it'd be so cool. Right now, I want to teleport to McDonald's and have a Big Mac. And then I want to teleport to the water park. Uh, Molly, you're not in real life. You're in Roblox. Yeah, well, at least I can teleport here. Molly, maybe you should teleport your school books into your locker since it's completely empty. Um, I may have forgotten my books at home. Whoopsie! Oh, great, Molly. Don't tell me you're going to get detention again. I hope not because my mom said I could have a sleepover. And she said we could only invite like one or two people. And guess what, Bricky? You're on the list. Really? I am? Yeah, you're my BFF. Who else are we going to invite? I don't know. You get to invite one more person. Who are you going to invite in besides me? I don't know. Definitely won't be seen with a bully. I got an invite to a sleepover. What are we going to do? Are we going to eat popcorn? Are we going to watch scary movies? Ah! Check and check. Whoa, the bell. Come on, you don't want to be late. Well, if you forgot all your books, you kind of want to be late because you don't want to get in trouble. Language class. I'm terrible at this. Good morning, everybody. Bonjour. Bonjour, teacher. Did everyone do their French homework last night? Um, but, but you said we didn't have homework. Just kidding. Molly, I'd like you to say a sentence in French, please. Uh -oh. Stand up in front of the class. Okay, um. Je suis un zapper. <laughs> Molly! Okay, no laughing at the class, please. I mean, class, no laughing at the student, please. I mean, you know what I mean. Wow, you can speak French, but your English is not that great right now. Well, okay, you're just making me feel frazzled. Don't tease each other, please, Molly. Try the sentence again, please. Okay, I thought I made it pretty clear. Je suis un zapper. Molly, you just said I am remote control. <laughs> well, I might be part robot. You never know. Oh, boy. Okay, Molly, take a seat, please. We have a new student coming today, and I want everybody to be polite. She doesn't have any friends here yet, and she could use some. Her old school had a bit of a crazy thing happen, and the school got shut down. The school shut down? Are you serious? Wow. Why'd she come here, then? If my school shut down, I wouldn't go to a new one. I'd be like, hallelujah, school is shut down. Best day ever. Molly, you may take your seat now. No, I'm serious. I'd be like, what? Do you want me to try to say that in French? Kwa! 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 Wow. Congratulations. You learned how to say one word in French. Uh, I guess I'm getting through to you somehow. Yeah. <laughs> I guess so. I'm going to do awesome on the test. Mm, uh, here's hoping, Molly. Wait a minute. We had a test? I didn't know about a test. What's she talking about? Oh, Daisy, don't freak out. There's no test. I'm just saying, when there is a test, I'm going to do well on it. <sighs> yeah, I don't think so, Molly. Would you like me to say that in French? Um, no. Vous avez échoué. What? Exactly, Molly. Oh, there's the new student now. Hi, Emily. Welcome to our school. Um, uh, hi. Whoa, she doesn't look too happy. Maybe if I'm friends with her, she'll be happy again. Hey, Emily, you can sit by me. My name is Molly. Um, 
Okay, thanks. So, Emily, uh, you sad about moving to a new school? I'm just sad around people these days. What? Sad around people? Yeah. Something really terrible happened at my last school. <gasps> it did? Um... Is everyone okay? No. No one is okay, except for me. I don't know how it even happened, but I have a guess. Um, I'm sorry something so terrible happened at your school. Um, hey, uh, my sister Daisy and I are really cool, nice people, and we're having a sleepover at our house tonight. Would you like to come? Really? You want me to come to your sleepover? Um, yeah. <laughs> sure, why not? I'll, um, text you my address. No, I, I don't have an iPhone. Don't text me. You could just send me a note. What? If we get caught in school with notes? <laughs> no passing is an immediate detention. Okay, well, you can just tell it to me at lunch, and I'll write it in my notebook. Wow, harsh. Her parents didn't even get her a phone. <laughs> Man, parents these days. <laughs> We did pick up friends who could heal. This is getting boring. I don't know, but they said they'd be here soon. So, you know, chill out. Molly, I don't know how to be chill. I like to do things. I don't like being a couch potato like you. Ow. And look who it is. Brookie. La, 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 da, da. Hey, Brookie. Oh, and Emily, too. <gasps> Come on in, girls. Let the party start. Molly, are you going to make us popcorn and pizza? And are we going to watch scary movies? Ah! Yes, yes, and yes. I will go get the pizza now. It's cooking in the oven. Holy cheesy pizza, does that smell good. Oh, that's making my stomach growl. <laughs> I can't wait to eat this pizza. I'm waiting like one piggy waits for another. Molly, you should wait for our friends. They should get the first piece. But I'm hungry. Molly, don't be rude to our guests. Wow, this pizza is so good. Yay, Emily's smiling. I'm so glad to see you're happy right now, Emily. Yeah, I'm just like, oh, I don't know, a little scared that the same thing might happen in my new town as my old school town. What? Nah. I don't know what happened there. You can talk to us about it if you want. Or you don't have to, but we're cool. Everything's going to be fine here in this new town. You just wait and see. Yeah, Emily, we're so excited that you're a part of our school. Yeah, exactly. I have to snap this. What? Why do you have Snapchat open? Close that right now! I didn't say that I would be on Snapchat. Close it! What? Um, th 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 but, uh, but everybody uses Snapchat. Uh, not I. I! I don't use Snapchat. Close it right now! Whoa, Emily. What's up with the attitude? That's not very nice. My sister just wanted to take a Snapchat of this really nice sleepover with you. I, 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 I don't think I can stand this sleepover. Wait, what? No, Emily, what's wrong? Tell us what happened. Yeah, come on, tell us what happened, because you're being kind of rude, and I thought you were going to be a good friend, but now I'm not sure what's going on with you. Molly, I'm sure she has a good explanation. Okay, you guys are going to think this is crazy. But everybody in my school started disappearing one by one. And when they came back, they weren't the same. Weird, crazy, strange things happened around my school. Strange things? Yeah, some people, they never returned. Some people came back. And it was like they were possessed. Evil. Like, like something was making them into a living puppet. <gasps> what? That can't be right. And what does a phone have to do with that? I just noticed that it would happen after someone put up a Snapchat. <laughs> ah, boring prank. Sounds like the oldest one in the book to me. What? I'm not pranking you. Yeah, boring. Ah, let's go watch the Scream movie. That's much scarier. I'm not pranking you. You have to believe me. Why do you think we moved to this town? Oh, Molly, I don't think she's kidding around. Sorry, I thought you were pranking me, Emily. I'm not pranking you. I'm telling you, you guys should never use Snapchat again. So this is why you don't have an iPhone. You're afraid of Snapchat? No, my parents are really old school. I never had a phone, which is probably why I'm the only one that didn't go crazy at my school. <laughs> Whoa, makes sense. Well, um... How do you know this is absolutely true, though? 
because Snapchat was the only thing that everyone had in common. Well, I say there's only one way to find out. Molly, put that phone away. You don't know what's going to happen. Uh-oh. Yeah, well, then, I think we should draw straws. Whoever gets the shortest straw has to test this concept by using Snapchat. I don't know if this is a good idea, Molly. Well, do you want to know if what happened to your classmates or not? We have to get to the bottom of it. Does everybody have their drink straw? Let me drink the strawberry shake first. <laughs> Delicious. Okay, who has the shortest straw? Oh, no. I have the shortest straw. I have to test the concept. It's nothing. If you went to my old school, old school, you wouldn't have thought it was nothing. Well, come on, let's make a Snapchat. No, I'm not gonna be in it. This thing might spread, and then I don't want to be possessed. Okay, Daisy. Well, you're on your own. Good luck with the demons. Ow. What? Okay, fine. I'll go into the bathroom and I'll Snapchat there. Nobody wants to hear you fart, Daisy. I I'm not gonna take a Snapchat of me farting, cheapos. Molly. Do you think that this is real? Well, Emily says it is. Guys, you need to believe me. It's real. Okay, Emily, we believe you, but we still want to test it, okay? Because maybe it was just a coincidence. Your sister's never going to be the same uh -oh. after this. Uh-oh. It was nice knowing you, Daisy. I don't know what the fuss was all about. Oh, ah! she's going to be crazy. I'm not crazy. Nothing bad even happened. Chip your snaps. Okay. Um... Daisy, you seem pretty normal. Let's go into stories and see. Oh, why can't I use my Snapchat right now? I don't know what's wrong with me. Not working. Weird. Oh, there we go. Daisy, I don't, I don't see anything. Wait. What's that behind Daisy? What? What do you mean? What's behind me? Guys, look at your snaps. Something really weird is happening. I don't have a phone, so I can't see, and I'm glad about it. I don't want to see anything. I see it, and, and it looks like there's some sort of creepy puppet behind Daisy. What? No, that's not. I took that snap myself, and there was nothing there. Um, Daisy, are you pranking us? No, I'm not pranking you. Go look at the bathroom. There's no creepy puppet in there. She's right, guys. There's nothing in here. Well, then where did this creepy puppet thing come from in your snap? I don't know, but I'm going to test this theory and see if it shows up on my Snapchat. That's such a bad idea, guys. Please. I can't lose my new friends, too. Don't worry. Everything's going to be fine. I'm just going to go out here in the garage and take a snap. I'm sure nothing's even happening right now. La, 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 la. Hmm. I see absolutely nothing. Hey, everybody. I'm just taking this snap because um, my new friend Emily said that if you use Snapchat, it basically possesses you. And I just I want to say that I think it's a myth because I don't see anything on my snap. And But Daisy saw something on hers. And I don't know. It was, might have just been a glitch or something. So I'm sending this to everybody so they can see nothing is there. There! I sent it, guys! Ah! Take a look at your snaps! Um, Molly? This isn't good! The puppet is behind you, too! Ah! Yeah, Molly, I see it on my screen, too! Huh? What? Let me see that. Oh my god! This is about to happen to me again! You guys are gonna disappear, and then, and then you're gonna turn evil! I just know it! Emily, it's gonna be fine. I'm sure that there's just some sort of explanation for this. No one's gonna disappear. Uh, Molly? Daisy just disappeared. What? D Daisy? Where'd she go? She vanished right in front of my eyes. Molly, that means you have less than 10 minutes until you vanish. Uh-oh. That's about the time between your Snapchats. Oh, um, gee. There's nothing you can do about it, Molly. You made a Snapchat. And the puppet is coming for you. <gasps> the puppet? Now this creepy thing has a name? Well, it shows up as a puppet. I never knew that before. What? I, 
Why'd you let us do this? Why? I tried to stop you, but you wouldn't listen. Oh my god. I'm gonna disappear, and then I'm gonna come back evil. Don't worry, Molly. I'm your best friend. I'm gonna try to figure this out. I, I hope. Well, what do I do for ten minutes? <coughs> I know. I gotta have a snack, because if I'm gonna be evil, I might not remember what it tastes like to eat something delicious. <laughs> Strawberry shortcake. Milkshake. <coughs> gotta put it in my tummy before I disappear. Molly, only you would be disappearing in like five minutes and you'd be eating food before you disappear. Well, I mean, priorities. Oh my god! Molly disappeared! Oh no. I tried to warn you guys this was going to happen, but the puppet, he came for both of them. But she was my best friend! Yeah, but you didn't make a snap, so maybe we could figure this out together. I hope so, Emily. I really hope so! Hello, Emily. Nice to see you. Um, ah, oh, it's the Snapchat puppet. Emily, what are we going to do? Maybe we could talk sense into her. It is still Daisy, right? I don't know. I don't like this, Emily. I don't like this at all. You shouldn't like it because... I'm the Snapchat puppet. Ha 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 ha. Crying, little baby. Now come with me, Emily. You're what we want. What? Why me? Why me? Because you got away from the last school, but you won't escape now. Now, look at Snapchat Puppet. Where am I? I don't know where I am. <laughs> Welcome to your nightmare. Am I in math class? What's going on? This is where you'll live forever with me, the Snapchat puppet. Wait, what? You brought me to math class? Oh, God. This is really the worst. What do you want from me? You will be one of me, a Snapchat puppet that will rule the world. Um, well, um, that sounds boring. Mm. Mm. What are you doing? I'm eating a cookie there, Ignoramus. What's it look like I'm doing? Why are you eating a cookie? I'm about to possess you. Aren't you scared? Um, not really. Because I'm just not. Not really scared of much, actually. Except for living without cookies. But since there's cookies in this crazy nightmare place, I'm good. What? No, you have to be afraid in order for me to possess you. Well, good luck with that. Hmm, you're not that scary. Like a Snapchat puppet or something? Like, what is that even? Are you making fun of me? W what? Um, well, if you're gonna bring me to math class and try to bully me, then I'm pretty much gonna be like... <laughs> did you just fart? Um, yeah. <laughs> I did. Mostly because I think this is so ridiculously stinky. Now let me out of here right now. No, you will be a Snapchat puppet. Whether you like it or not. Now be afraid. Okay, Mr. Snapchat Puppet. Let me tell you something. I've been playing Roblox for a real long time. I've faced Chucky. I've faced, uh, let's see, almost every obby ever created. I escaped Evil Granny. Ooh, she was a creepy one. Uh oh. Piggy, Siren Head. Would you like me to go on? What? I'm the evilest one of them all on Roblox. <laughs> Not even close. Have you seen our Bloody Mary video? <laughs> Still gives me chills. You guys should watch that one if you haven't seen it. Anyway, back to this evil Snapchat puppet. I'm not afraid of you. Now, how do I get out of here? You can't. Actually, I just opened the door. Uh -oh. This isn't even an alternate dimension. It's just at my school. You're a lame bad guy. Bye. Ow. Emily, Brookie. Oh, my God. Daisy. <gasps> oh, Molly. Please, don't try to hurt us! What? What are you talking about? I'm fine. Wait, what? Emily, stop crying! Why is she normal? I don't like that! Um, Daisy, enough with this Snapchat puppet thing. Oh my gosh, she wants me! It's the only way to make the Snapchat puppet go away! And to give me your sister back! 
Wait, what? No, I'll just offer her a cookie. She loves these. Daisy, here, eat this cookie. I don't think so, little girl. <laughs> I've got your sister. Now give me Emily or else. What's so great about Emily? She has powers to see the future. Seriously, is that true, Emily? Well, um, maybe a little. Well, you didn't mention that. It's okay. I'll go with the Snapchat puppet. No, we're not doing that. Yes, you are. Say goodbye to your friend Emily. She already agreed. Wait, what? Emily? Snapchat puppet, you bring back our new friend. Here's your lame sister. Ha 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 ha. What a nerd. She just kept thinking about science this entire time. Daisy? Daisy, say something. I love science. I love it. What, what happened? Daisy, are you okay? Yeah, I'm all right, but what happened? The Snapchat puppet, it possessed you. I can't believe this. Where, where's Emily? I don't know. Oh my God, I don't even know what to do. Wait a minute, I do. Molly, why do you sound like you're fooled by now? This is such a bad idea. Because I have a feeling that Emily's gonna be stuck inside Snapchat. I don't see her, Molly. Where is she? I don't see her evil. She's she's not gonna show up on Snapchat. Guys, the puppet, he's got me. No, there she is, she's on our Snapchat. Emily, just try to resist. Don't give in to the Snapchat puppet. It's no use. I'm one with him now. I'm one with the Snapchat puppet forever. I see. to be a good student. Wow, congratulations, Molly. Yay! Hopefully you can actually succeed. Well, uh, <laughs> no promises. Whoa, I wonder who that could be. It's probably Brookie. She texted me earlier and said her mom is going on this health kick, so she's only putting fruits and vegetables in the house. Yeah. And she knows we have donuts. <laughs> Coming, Brookie! Where's Brookie? Maybe she's already in the kitchen eating a donut. No, no, Brookie. What? what? Did Amazon deliver a package? Oh boy, I love presents. Maybe my mom got me one because I've been doing my homework lately. Whoa, Molly, where's Brookie? Um, she's not here, but... You got a present, I know. Did Brookie bring that? No, it was just out front. I think maybe Amazon delivered it. Let me see that. To Molly and Daisy? From a secret admirer? <gasps> Someone wants to ask me to the dance. La 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 la. Well, then why would it be to both of us? Oh yeah, good point. I thought it was because I was doing my homework, but you always do your homework, so why should you get a prize? Hey, wait a minute. That doesn't seem fair. Well, let's open it and find out who it's from. Daisy, it's an invitation. An invitation to what? I hereby announce that you've been invited to a royal sleepover? What? That's amazing. Yeah, but who invited us? Love your secret admirer. I don't know. Hmm, something seems kind of fishy about this, Molly. I don't know if we should go. Are you kidding me? I know exactly who it's from. It could be for some crazy person <laughs> who just wants us to go to their house. Or it could be from that new famous YouTuber that just moved into Brookhaven, but she wants to keep her new friends on the down low, so she's invited us over to her mansion. I don't know, Molly, but you could be right, so we should at least go and check it out. And the sleepover's tonight, so we've got to go pack a bag. Come on, Daisy. This is so exciting. Why did you put the package in the elevator? Oopsie, I didn't mean to stash the box in there. I guess I was supposed to take it to the trash. <laughs> now it's stuck in the elevator. Okay, that's kind of funny. Come on, Daisy, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. All right, all right, I'm ready, Molly. Jeepers creepers. 
I still don't know about this. Daisy, you jumped over the railing. You're not supposed to do that. Mom said you'll get a timeout. Well, I'm just so excited. I couldn't think as to wait. And I just want to get to the sleepover. I thought you thought it was going to be creepy. Well, I'm not sure yet. But I can't wait to find out. And look at Molly. A limo actually came to pick us up. Holy guacamole. Fancy. This is going to be an amazing sleepover. I just know it. Come on, Daisy, get in. Molly, seriously? Are you going to hang your head out the sunroof the entire ride? Well, the driver decided that he was going to not show up, so I'm just going to drive us over there. I have the address and everything. Well, drive careful. You don't want to chop my head off on one of those bridges. Well, then you better actually get in here. Can't. Have to have so much fun. Whee! <laughs> Never drove in a limo before. Whee! <laughs> Holy macaroni! Is this where the sleepover is? I think so, Molly. This is where the address was. Wow. I bet they're going to have the most delicious pizza ever. Oh, great. What are you losers doing here? What are we doing here? What are you doing here? I'm here for the exclusive sleepover. Duh. And you guys are way too well losers to do the sleepover. Oh, yeah? Well, here's our invitation, Sarah. We got one, too. Wait, you got an invitation, Sarah? Uh, yeah, duh. Hey, guys, what's up? Brookie, what are you doing here? I got an invitation to a really cool sleepover at this amazing mansion. But wait a minute. I thought this was a hotel that closed down years ago. Well, obviously somebody bought it and moved in here and made it a house. I think that's amazing. I don't know about this, guys. Something is telling me in my tummy that this isn't right. What are you talking about? It's probably an invite from that new famous YouTuber that moved into Brookhaven. That's exactly what I told her, Sarah. Whoa. We actually thought alike like for once, Sarah. I don't think so. I would never think like you. You're an ignoramus. Hey, look, we all got invited to this sleepover, Sarah, which means we all need to get along. I don't know, Maddie. I think we should go home. Don't be ridiculous. This place looks amazing. Who's going? Um, I am. I am. And so am I. Daisy, and around. Okay, fine. But only because I don't want you guys to get in trouble without me. Come on, guys, let's go. Whoa, look at this place. Yeah, it's amazing. What was that? It was the sound of the door locking. Wait, what? No, no that can't be right. Uh, 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 the, the door is locked. Molly, I told you this was a bad idea. Um, well, like, let's nobody panic. I mean, it's probably just a lock-in party. Those are very exclusive. Yeah, guys, look at the size of this television. It's amazing. Uh, Brookie, I don't think that's a television. I think that's actually, like, where you check in. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Oopsie. It kind of looked like a TV to me. But look at this. They have an indoor pool. Isn't that amazing? Yeah, um, I'm sure it's just one of those lock-in parties. Right, Daisy? I don't know. I told you I felt really crazy about this before we got here. And now it's in an old abandoned hotel. And where's the people who are hosting the party? Yeah, that's a good question. Where's the host? What just happened to the lights? I, 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 I. OMG, Molly. This is freaking me out. Yeah, me too. Oh, wait, the lights just came back on. Maybe it's just short-circuited. Now, where is that host that's, like, supposed to be here to celebrate this sleepover with us? I'm sure they're around here somewhere. Maybe they didn't hear us show up. Um, I think they heard us because, well, uh, the door locked. Molly, I think I just saw the host! What? 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 Ridiculous. There's nobody standing behind Sarah. Oh, the 
this is so lame. Where's all the pizza? Oh my god! Did you guys just see that? It was like a ghost or something. Ah! Oh my god, this was a really bad idea. <laughs> the doors are locked. We can't even get out of here. What are we gonna do now? It's, 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 it's a ghost. We are gonna try not to panic. Okay, everybody huddle together. We have to decide what to do. <laughs> But you never listen to me. Well, I just think the sleepover is lame. Of course it's lame. It's given by a ghost or something. Well, guys, let's just think about this, okay? We just have to try to survive the night. And then maybe the doors will unlock in the morning. I've seen this movie, I think, before. Really? I don't know, but one like it. So let's go upstairs and see if we can find a bedroom. Well, we can't barricade the door or anything because the ghost can still get in. No, but we should try to get some rest. I mean, I'm sure this isn't the last we've seen of the ghost. Well, first maybe we should check the refrigerator. I'm hungry. <laughs> a few minutes later. What? No refrigerator? This really is a creepy nightmare sleepover! Wait, I smell something. It smells kind of like food. Ooh. <laughs> Score! Mm, that's pretty good, actually. Mm -hmm. Marley, that could be poison. Stay away from that. Doesn't taste like poison. Okay, for good. Ay, 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 Marley, come on. Let's go up to the bedroom that we can find and 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 try to get some rest. Molly, if I have to be trapped in a creepy hotel with anyone, I'm glad it's my BFF. Oh. Me too, me too. Okay, let's stay in Emerald Room. That seems like a good room, right? Wow, everything's so green. <laughs> She's in this room! Nope, Emerald Room is a definite no! Definite no on the Emerald Room! Let's find a different one. Holy guacamole! Next floor, please! Ooh. The Royal Room? This seems pretty cool. I am, I am royalty! Wow! This is a pretty posh bathroom. Yep, this one's a go for me. And if there's no ghost, that's even better. Look at this artwork, though. That artwork looks like it has eyes. It's kind of creeping me out. Molly, where's everyone else? I don't know. Maybe they got lost on the way. Or maybe they're not royalty, so they can't stay here. <laughs> Molly, I don't think that's it. But seriously, though, what's up with the artwork in this hotel? Like, this is art? It looks like a prison cell. <laughs> they need to upgrade their art here. Um, where is my sister, though? And where is Sarah? Wait, how do I get out of this room? All right, here's the door. Let's go see if I can find them. Daisy, Sarah, where are you? Come on, we're in the royal room. Molly, did you find Sarah and Daisy? No, I think we better go back to the first floor. Maybe they got lost on the way here. After we saw that ghost, everybody sort of just scattered. Rookie, look, it's a grown-up. Hi, hi, I'm Molly, and, and I got this creepy invitation. Well, I didn't think it was creepy, but it's actually creepy. And, 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 and I, I... Molly, slow down. He can't understand anything you're saying. Okay, I got this invitation to come to a sleepover here, but when I got here, all there was was a creepy ghost, and she locked us in! Creepy ghost, you say, huh? Mmm, I see. Can you help us? Call 911! Or open the door or something! <laughs> <gasps> Molly, why is he laughing like that? <laughs> Seriously, why are you laughing like that? Do you have, like, a laughing thing that you do? Like, is that how you laugh? <laughs> yeah, his laugh is pretty weird. <laughs> Molly, I don't think that was a, I don't know, that was a grown-up. <laughs> I fooled you. Can you see me now? <laughs> no one could ever see me. I was a lost soul. Lost soul? Did she used to go to our school? Oh my god! It's the legend of Marie! What? What are you talking about? The legend of Marie! Everybody knows the legend of Marie! 
Yeah, Molly. She just disappeared one day. They said everyone bullied her so much and didn't pay attention to her that she literally vanished. <gasps> what? Ah! Ah! We're stuck in this hotel with Crazy Marie? Ah! Molly, what are we going to do? I don't know, but I would say whatever we do, no one falls asleep. Do you understand? Yes, Molly. I won't fall asleep. Trust me. Well, I'm kind of tired right now. So... Wake up, Brookie. This is no time for sleeping. And where is Sarah? I don't know, Molly. But I think maybe we... She took... Brookie! Don't close your eyes! Don't! Oh, sorry. I'm just so sleepy. I didn't get enough sleep last night. And so tonight I was like... Wondering if I was going to be able to stay awake for the sleepover, and the answer is probably no. Well, get serious about staying awake because there she is again! Ah! <laughs> I, I just want, want to be seen. Let's play! I never had a sleepover. Blah! Molly! Sorry, I tried to hold it in, but when I get nervous, I sort of fart a lot. <laughs> Ew, Molly, that smells like a bean burrito. With rotten eggs on top. <laughs> uh, oopsie. I don't know where Sarah is, but Marie is not going to take us down. Huddle in close, friends. We're about to discuss our plan. <laughs> oh, Molly, you still smell like a rotten egg. Why are you making us come in close? Well, unless you want Marie to hear us. My plan is this. Look, everybody knows what happened to Marie. Everybody ignored her or bullied her. And she just sort of disappeared. So maybe if we listen to her and tell her we'll be her friend, she'll stop haunting this old hotel. I don't know, Miley. That's risky. I don't see how we have any other choice. I mean, she's got us locked in here. Yeah, she has a point, Daisy. We have to try. Okay, well, I, I guess we can try. All right, let's split up. Absolutely not! Are you crazy? Okay, well... If we want to have a chance of talking to her, we should probably do it one-on-one. -on -one. We don't want her to think we're going to bully her. She's got a point, Daisy. Okay, I'll go upstairs to one of those creepy rooms. I'll go to the kitchen, because if we send Molly to the kitchen, she'll get distracted and just want to eat food the entire time. Hey, that doesn't sound like a bad idea. <laughs> okay, I'll stand in front of the elevator, because that's where she seems to appear the most. Just remember... Be really nice. <gasps> okay, okay, don't be freaked out. Hi, Marie, it's me, Molly, and, um, I don't know where you went. Maybe back into the walls or something, but I just wanted to say I know what happened to you at Brookhaven High, and it wasn't your fault. You were probably a good person, and everyone ignored you. And when you tried to say, hey, I'm Marie, people bullied you. That wasn't fair. Go away! Listen, I can be your friend, Marie. I promise, I'm a good friend. I mean, I don't do my homework very often, so don't ask me for tutoring. But I know how to have fun. I know how to make pizza. Pizza, Marie. Remember when you used to love pizza? Wait, did you like pizza? Are you lactose intolerant? Too much talking! I don't like talking! Well, um, maybe you just need someone to listen. I'm a pretty good listener. Do you want me to listen? Oh. Well, I guess so. Ah! Oh, you're, you're creepy looking. Thanks, that's not a real good way to start a friendship. No one has seen me for 50 years. Whoa. Really? No, just kidding. <laughs> it's only been 10, but <laughs> you believed it, which was kind of funny. Jeez, I can't imagine why nobody wanted to be your friend. Also a joke. <laughs> Okay, don't make me go back to ghost status, because I will. Whoa, calm down. Calm down. Anyway, my name is Molly, and my sister Daisy's here. My best friend, Brookie, and, well, Sarah. She's not the nicest, but, you know, we tolerate her. <laughs> um, well, do you want to be my friend? <gasps> of course I'd be your friend. I don't know if I could ever go back to Brookhaven. I mean... Everyone teased me and then just ignored me. Well, you could be our friend, but you have to stop being a ghost. I I can try. You can do this. I know you can, Marie. Just think happy thoughts. 
think I have friends. Marie, you're doing it! Marie, you did it! I feel so, so human. That's because you are human, Marie. And you're important. And you matter. Oh. Yes, I've never had a friend like you. Uh, but could we never go back to that creepy Marie where you talk like, Aah! and also, um, you're like a ghost? Yeah, that was pretty creepy. Sorry about that. And where's our friend Sarah? Oh, um, I just heard that she was kind of a bully, so I, uh, stuck her in a wall. What? Uh, Bree, you probably should undo that. That's a little bit psycho behavior. Okay, okay, no problem. And also, would you mind unlocking the door? Yeah, but you are going to be my friend after you walk out the door, right? Marie, of course. Uh, you know, you don't have to force me to be your friend just so I can leave. We'll just be your friend. Oh, I see Marie is back to her normal self. That's good. Um, try not to be crazy again. Uh -oh. Hey, it wasn't all her fault. She had a rough childhood. Well, thanks for being my friends, guys, and coming for my coming to my sleepover. Well, it was definitely the most creepiest one I've ever been to. <laughs> so you win an award for that. For sure. But Marie, we're here for you. We're your friends now. I don't want to watch this. I get to run and watch a cookie. Well, too bad. We're eating cookies and we're watching the gymnastics competition. Yeah, baby Q, we've been waiting all week to watch this. I can't wait to see my favorite gymnast. She's up next. Special news report. Sorry, we have to interrupt your gymnastic competition. What? Oh, uh, they always do this every time. <laughs> we can watch Coco Manny. There's nothing on but this news channel. What are they talking about? Well, a woman went missing for years, but our big news today, Stephanie, is that it's Wear Your Favorite Color Day. And guess what? If you wear your favorite color, you get a free ice cream. Wow. Say what? Oh my God, this is amazing. It's a fashionista's dream. Wear my favorite color, get an ice cream. How do they know if you're being honest about what your favorite color is, though? I mean, what if your favorite color is blue like me, but you wear pink? They're just trusting you, man. <gasps> oh, wow, that's pretty nice of them. Well, I'm going to wear my favorite color. Oh, wait, I already am. No, Molly, you have to wear your favorite color all the way from top to bottom. And I have to paint my skin blue? <laughs> okay, that's a little weird. I'll show you what, how to do it, Molly, because I'm a fashionista and I know this kind of stuff. Boom, perfect. Pink is obviously my favorite color. I even have a pink lollipop. Holy guacamole, Daisy. <gasps> your hair looks so different. Well, it's wear your favorite color day, so I decided to take down my pigtails and dye my hair pink. Whoa. <laughs> You're definitely going to get the free ice cream. All right, well, I guess it's my turn. And what's your favorite color, baby Kiwa? Rainbow. Uh, baby Kiwa, you don't understand the assignment. It's supposed to be your favorite color. I don't stand, I told you. Rainbow! <laughs> I didn't know what it is. No, you're just supposed to pick one color. Just let her do what she wants. She's a baby. I'm sure they'll give her a free ice cream anyway. <laughs> I got it, you know. <laughs> okay, well, um, let's get dressed. We can put our ice cream. No, we're getting twisted our favorite colors because we love being our favorite color. No, I'm just doing it so I can get free ice cream. Why are you so tall? Take off those heels. I don't think so. I think these heels look adorable on me. Yeah, but they make you look a giant. Uh, correction. They make me fabulous. <coughs> Is everybody ready to go? Molly, what are you wearing? My imposter costume for last Halloween. It's the bluest thing I own. I'm blue. I'm blue. Molly, I am not being seen out in public with you wearing that. What? I think I look great. I did it, I did it, I did it, I did it, Oh, baby Kira, look at how cute she looks in that little rainbow dino sweatshirt. She looks adorable. 
That is a cute hoodie. But Molly, we are not going like that. Too bad I'm going like that. We are going for ice cream. Let's go. <coughs> Molly, you can't even walk in that costume. You just sort of waddle. Well, <laughs> too bad. Actually, I'll be waddling after I eat all that ice cream anyway, so I don't really care. Ay, ay, ay. I can't believe this girl is my sister. Watch this. This is so cool about Roblox. I'm totally going to teleport. <gasps> do, 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 do. <laughs> awesome. Uh, Dizzy, why did you bring your own spoon? <laughs> they have spoons at Coastal Combs. What? What are you talking about? On the side of your bag, there's a spoon there. What? Wait, that's not a spoon. It's the handle to my bag. Um, okay. Anybody who's watching this video right now, slam the like button if you think Daisy's purse looks like it has a spoon on it. Come on, that looks like a spoon. It's not a spoon. Uh, this is a very fashionable bag. It looks like a spoon. I did not wear a spoon on my purse. Ay, ay, ay. Hey, Molly, look, there's a fitness center over there. We could work out after we get our ice cream. The only thing I'm worried about is fitting this whole ice cream cone in my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, very funny. Welcome to Coastal Cones. <sighs> what can I get for you? Yuck, we're very good food, good combo, and we get free ice cream cone. Oh, look, I haven't heard that all day. I mean, my favorite color. Give me an ice cream cone. What are you supposed to What are you supposed to be, a blockhead? Um, no. It's my costume from last Halloween. And it's from that game of long ass, and my favorite color is blue. Could I have a strawberry ice cream with two scoops, please, for free? Whatever. Here you go. Yeah. Being wearing your favorite color, Daisy, she sure is grumpy. Hey, what's your favorite color? I don't have a favorite color. Say what? You don't have a favorite color? Who on earth doesn't have a favorite color? Apparently she doesn't, the ice cream worker. You might not want to eat that lollipop while you're also eating that ice cream. You're gonna rot your teeth. Um, yeah, okay, I'll have a chocolate ice cream cone, please. Excuse me, I didn't order strawberry, I ordered chocolate. Too bad, that's what you get. Um, yeah, okay. I am a, a rainbow ice cream. You get this watermelon. She obviously is not very happy about it being your favorite color, Jay. I hate it. I've had to work twice as hard at this ice cream shop today because the owner said I had to give out free ice cream. Mwah. I think that would make you really happy that you got to be so nice to people. Well, it doesn't. Come on, sisters. Let's go over to the beach and relax while we have ah! ice cream. Hey, you don't have to say thank you to me or anything. It's not like I've been working all day. What'd she say? Man, she was grumpy. Snapchat, Snapchat. Set me free. Take these colors away from me. Daisy, what is going on with your hair? <gasps> and your clothes. You look like Corella DeVille. What? What are you talking ah! about? Whoa, what are you guys wearing? Baby Kill, why are you dressed out in black? And Molly, what is what is up with you? What? What are you talking about? I'm wearing my costume. <gasps> it's a totally different one. It's just black and white. I get from Alien or some creepiness right there. O-M-G. We've been cursed. What? what are you talking about? It's in the ice cream, I bet. Stop eating it. Wait, but why? Why would we be cursed? I think you the ice cream person who gave us the ice cream mask and she made it turn black and white. And she made it turn black and white. Wait, what? Why would she do that? Um, because she's really angry about having to serve this much ice cream today. Did you not notice? Guys, I think the town is looking a little black and white too. O-M-G! Let's go talk to her. Maybe she'll change your mind. Oh, maybe she'll tell us what the antidote is for the ice cream cones. Ha 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 This is perfect. No more serving ice cream to all you brats. What? That's not very nice. You are more like the ice cream than the ice cream, Silver. 
That's right, I am the Ice Queen. <laughs> I make everyone's heart turn to ice and everything black and white. <gasps> well, um, I was wondering, uh, could you kind of turn us back because I like pink. It's my favorite color. I don't think so. I just asked Snapchat to take all the colors away and everybody's losing their color one at a time until the entire town has been washed of color. <laughs> so you did this with Snapchat? Jeepers, I thought it was something you put in the ice cream. Nope. Snapchat granted my wish. Holy guacamole. Well then, if that's true, I'm gonna put out my Snapchat. Hey everybody, it's Daisy and don't even bother. I'm the Ice Queen and I'm in charge of Snapchat. Oh really, are you? Then what's this rainbow color? <laughs> oh Daisy, you're starting to sound like the evil one. Wait a minute! That put a rainbow face on me too! How could this be? Well, I just happen to be amazing at Snapchat. And obviously your spell with Snapchat isn't working any longer. It is because everything is black and white. Listen, if you hate your job at the ice cream shop, maybe you should try something else. I mean, evil ice cream's working for you pretty good. Wait, are you saying that I should try getting a different job? Yeah. You don't like the one you got, obviously, if you're turning the whole town black and white. Cheapers, creepers. Career change for you is necessary, I think. I do your job. I love ice cream, and I bet you get free cones, don't you? I like ice cream. If you work at ice cream shop, I will be there when you eat the ice cream with you, Molly. Oh. I don't have to serve ice cream to brats anymore? Huh. Why didn't I think of this before? <laughs> I'm off to be an evil villain. <laughs> now hear me, world. I am the villain Ice Queen. Is she seriously standing on top of the picnic table? <laughs> uh, Molly, just let her have a moment. Obviously, she's totally crazy. <laughs> I will make the whole world black and white. <laughs> Whoa, losing my balance. Whoa. <laughs> uh, um, I'm thinking maybe she's not very really good at being a villain either. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what her job should be. Whoa, Molly, Jack, a big ice cream cone bar with the freaking. I'm thinking that if we start serving everybody ice cream again, the world will go back to color. Ooh, that would be wonderful. Well, let's start with us. This ice cream looks delicious. I want some blueberry flavor. Mmm. A pile on some watermelon. What else makes me happy? Chocolate, strawberry, and mint chocolate chip. Woo, this ice cream looks so good. Daisy, it worked. Yay! We're back to our normal selves. And our town is back to color too. Um, the evil villain is still laying out there. And she's still black and white. It's because she's not happy. I think if we start giving everybody ice cream, everything will be back to normal. Agreed, Molly. Hey guys, welcome to my Snapchat. Today I'm working at Coastal Cones. And if you're still black and white, don't worry. I can change you back to color and you get a free cone while you're doing it. Head on down, guys. You think that will work, Daisy? Ah, uh, well, here's our first customer. Hey, guys. Luke, <gasps> is that you? Yeah, I got the black and white curse and uh, I need to have some ice cream to see if I can get rid of it. What's your favorite? Mint chocolate chip. You got it. Mint and chocolate. Eat this and you should be back to color in no time. Wow, this ice cream is delicious. What happened to us anyway? Well, basically there was an evil ice queen that used a Snapchat curse to turn the entire town black and white, including us. And um, wear your favorite color day. I know, I was so excited about wear your favorite color day. She did that. Yeah, she was really unhappy with her job. Whoa, it worked! Can you guess what my favorite color is? Um, green. You guessed it, Molly. You know me so well. 
Uh, yeah, we've been friends since preschool. Of course I do. Molly, what are you doing? Uh, last year's Halloween costume because my favorite color is blue, duh. Oh, <laughs> I should have known you would have done that. So there you have it, guys. Make sure you're using your Snapchat for good and not evil. Don't try to take people's colors away or their happiness away. Don't bully or be mean on Snapchat. Just be yourself and then other people will be themselves too. And come on down to Coaster Cones if you want a free ice cream cone. All right, guys, have a wonderful day. And don't forget to subscribe. Bye! And Daisy and I want to show you this amazing fan video that we found on YouTube. And today's video is going to be based on this fan art. It says Molly and Daisy, but they're evil twins, Polly and Maisie. Bam, bam, bam! Oh my god, this is amazing. Ah! Oh my gosh, Polly is so creepy. Look at Maisie! Whoa! I like my little pumpkin barrette. Yeah, it's adorable. Until you turn into that. <laughs> awesome artwork. Shout out to Maria. We love it. And today's video is going to be based on your fan art. Molly, are you feeling okay? Not really. That Starbucks we got, it upset my stomach really bad. But it's making me feel kind of sleepy. That's just happening because you ate too much, Molly. I hardly ate anything. All I had was one muffin, one sandwich, and two lattes. Ali, that's a lot of food. So that's what I normally eat. Oh, I don't feel so good. Maybe a good night's sleep will make you feel better, Molly. I hope so. Oh. See you next morning. was poison! What? What are you talking about, Molly? This is a terrible prank. Why are we put in this jail cell? I don't know, but help! Help! Meanwhile... Well, Polly, it seems that I've hacked into their bank accounts. Perfect, Maisie. I hear their mom coming. Come on, pretend you're asleep. Okay, but, but I'm still uncracking all of the bank accounts. Well, do it after she wakes us up. We're already awake. Maisie! Just trust me on this. Girls, come on. It's time to wake up. I thought maybe we could go school shopping today. We could take Brookie along if you want. Go away. Well, Molly, that's not very nice. Whoa, do you have pink eye? What's going on with your eyes? No, my eyes are just fine. I just stayed up too late, so they're a little red. Whoa, Daisy, your eyes look red too. I think you guys need to see the eye doctor. I think you both might have pink eye. Our eyes are fine, lady. Whoa, lady? I was your mama just last night. Now all of a sudden I'm just lady? Would a lady make you breakfast? Pancakes? Sorry, mom. Yeah, we'll eat your crummy pancakes. What has gotten into you? Nothing, mom. She's fine. Maisie, pull it together before she figures out that we're not Molly and Daisy. Oh, sorry, mom. I just woke up on the wrong side of the bed. No problem. Everybody has difficult mornings. Now come on, let's go eat breakfast. Molly, I know how much you love extra peanut butter on your pancakes with a little bit of syrup, so that's exactly how I made them for you. Ew, pancakes with syrup and peanut butter? You love peanut butter, what are you talking about? Not on my pancakes, that's disgusting. Molly, are you feeling okay? You love to have peanut butter and then syrup. It's like your favorite. Ew, gross, Mom. Okay, well, I guess you're growing up now and you don't like the same things. It just seems kind of weird to me. Okay, Mom, well, can you leave us alone now? Hey, Polly, you're supposed to like the same things as Molly, remember? You're going to give us away. Oh, yeah, true. Um, hey, we're going to go play with our best friend. Wait, what's her name? Um, 
Brookie? Yeah, we're gonna go play with her and then when we come back, can we go school shopping? Sure, but only be a couple of hours, girls, okay? Because I'm gonna do some laundry and clean up the house a bit and then we're gonna leave, okay? Okay, fine. Come on, let's go. The pressure to be exactly like Molly around this lady is driving me crazy. Who's that? I don't know, but I don't know, she doesn't run into us. Hey guys, what's up? Uh, hi, do we know you? We don't talk to strangers. <laughs> you are being so silly right now, Molly. Apparently she knows who we are. Um, did you guys both get bonks on the head? Uh, it's me, Brookie. Oh, Brookie! Our best friend? Yeah, our best friend, yeah. What do we like to do, Brookie? You girls are acting really, really weird. What's up with your eyes? They're so red. Do you guys have pink eye or something? No, we just have red eyes, okay? Leave it alone already. Now, what should we do for fun? Um, well, you guys like to ride bikes, right? So uh, I could ride my skateboard. You could ride bikes. Perfect. Now, where's my bike? Molly, you keep it locked in the garage for safekeeping. Remember? Oh, yeah, exactly. Um, Molly, what's Daisy doing? I'm going to take Dad's motorcycle. Riding bikes is boring. She doesn't even know how to ride a motorcycle. Of course I do. Now I don't got to ride it. The motorcycle is lame. Well, you heard her. She wants to ride a motorcycle. Um, you guys are acting really strange today. I think maybe I'll go home. No, don't go home. Then we got to hang out with that lady inside and I don't want to. You mean your mom? Did she make you pancakes for breakfast? Yeah, why? Well, then maybe you should be nicer to her. I mean, she always makes you something delicious for breakfast and... I'm back. Who wants to ride on my Harley? I will. Sounds fun. See you later, Brookie, since you don't want to hang out with us. Um, okay. Wow, those guys are acting so weird. Um, let's get out of here, Maisie. I cannot stand being around these people anymore. Maybe we could go rob a bank or something. Hey, uh, low profile? Duh. We're supposed to be taking over Molly and Daisy's life, not making everyone think that we're bad guys. Exactly. Wait, why are we trying to take over their lives? So we have a pre free place to stay. Pancakes every morning? Yeah, that's true. That sounds like the good life to me, but I still want to rob the bank. <laughs> oh, this Maisie, she is so annoying. Okay, well, all right, I'm taking the motorcycle. Have fun. Hey, get back here. Oh, man, I don't have any money, and I want Starbucks. I'm starving. Well, good thing I've solved that problem. What? Maisie, look at all that cash. You didn't want me to rob the bank, but you sure want to use my money when you need something from Starbucks. Well, she does have a point. <laughs> well, 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 who do we have here? Two losers, Molly and Daisy. I don't know who you think you are, but you've come to Molly and Daisy. Yeah, that's who. On the wrong day. What, loser? What are you saying? I'm saying that shirt is so last season and it makes me want to throw up along with your face. What? What did you just say? Yeah, why are you always bullying everybody? Obviously, you're not even that good at it. What? What? And your shoes are gross. It looks like you stepped in dog poop in them. Yeah. Ugly. That's what you are. Yeah, I'm going to spray it with this fire extinguisher. <laughs> Get out of here, bully! Oh my god, I don't know what happened to Molly and Daisy, but they're the worst bullies, even worse than me! <laughs> Way to go! This was amazing, Polly! Yeah, good job, Maisie! I don't know who that bully was, but apparently we got rid of her real fast. Girls, there you are! You've been gone for hours and hours and hours! I told you to come back in two hours so we could go school clothes shopping! Well, it looks like it didn't make any difference to you. You're still doing dishes. Well, th that's not the point. I told you to come back in two hours. Ah, fine. Well, at least I made you each bean burritos. You know, I thought you'd be hungry. Wow, that's cool, lady. Why are you guys calling me lady? I'm your mom. Now go sit down. You can eat your bean burritos. Okay. Does she even know that I don't really like bean burritos? Must be Molly really likes them. Well, Molly, that's your second bean burrito, and, well, nothing's happening. What should happen? Except for the fact it's giving me heartburn. Heartburn? No, 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 no. You haven't even farted. Not even one time. Huh? What? No, I never fart from bean burritos. What? I have my gas meter out, and, and no gas has come out of you at all. You're an imposter. Where's Molly? What? What are you talking about? You are not my daughter. Where is she? Daisy, we're never going to get out of here. Don't say that, Molly. Someone will eventually figure out that we're down here. What's that delicious smell? It smells like 
smells like mom's making bean burritos. Oh boy, how we missing bean burritos. Smells so good. <laughs> Ew, mom, he was stuck in the same prison cell. Why'd you do that? Because if I even smell a bean burrito, I fart. Somebody help! I'm stuck down here and it smells really bad. Another snowstorm. Mm, this donut tastes pretty good, though. Maybe it's not as cold out as I think it is. Oh no, it's freezing. Oh, totally, Molly. But that's okay. We can always find something fun to do inside. Yeah, like your donuts, Molly. It's a new year. It could be a new year, new you. Blah blah blah. I like the old me. Well, um, the old you wears terrible outfits. And, um, eats way too many donuts. So judgy, this one. Listen, I like Molly just the way she is. If you don't, that's your problem, girlfriend. Well, I'm just saying, I think you'd be really, really helped out by my new TikTok idea. You have TikTok? Well, not yet, but I'm going to sign up. It's called New Year, New You. Oh, like I haven't heard that one before. Yeah, but it's all about, like... Having great fashion, um, even cooking healthy meals. Well, pretty soon, in about a week, you can turn your TikTok channel to eating terrible meals for beginners or for advanced people. Because basically, everybody in the new year wants to be healthy and whatever for like a week, and then they just decide, nah, and they eat all the donuts. <laughs> I just skip all that and just keep eating the donuts. Molly, seriously, stop eating that donut. I'm going to make an amazing TikTok. Now stay out of the kitchen and don't interrupt my healthy cooking TikTok. Yeah, okay, whatever. She gone. Okay. Back to eating a delicious donut. As you can see here, I'm making a delicious apple that's baked in the oven. Super delicious and good for you. Hey, I'm Molly, her slob of a sister. I dress bad and I eat way too many donuts. Molly, get out of my TikTok. <laughs> I'm pushing send. <laughs> it's uploaded on your TikTok. Nah, 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 nah. Molly, how could you? Wait a minute. I already got 10 likes on that. Wait, what? They think that we're funny together? Yeah. You're funny looking. Molly, rude! Oh my god, now we have a thousand people liking it. Oh my god, Molly! It went up to 50,000! What? It's been like 30 seconds. Mm. I'm getting more TikTok subscribers before I even finish this donut. Ugh. Okay, now I got a little bit of a stomach ache. And these pants are getting a little tight. Molly! We're going to be TikTok famous. So, TikTok fans, if you want to have these adorable pigtails like I have, you just have to brush your hair exactly like this. Daisy, get out of the bathroom. I have to go. <laughs> Molly, I'm making a TikTok. What do you want? I need to use the potty. Seriously, Molly? Well, I guess it's TikTok gold. Well, whatever, but get out. Okay, TikTok fans, I'm going to show you how to get your beach body just in time for spring break. That's why right, let's start off with some jumping jacks in this new year, new you. Um, you could do all that, or you could say whatever, and sit on your couch and eat lots of donuts, till your pants don't fit, till your stomach explodes, sounds like the good life to me. Molly! You could have ruined another TikTok. Ha ha ha. I don't think I'm ruining them. Everybody loves my personality. Holy guacamole. Macaroni and cheese. Hot dogs with ketchup. Yeah, Molly, we get the point. Food, food, and food. I can't believe that our TikTok has 1.5 million people that are our fans. I know, right? This is amazing. We should go celebrate with um food. Molly, no. New Year, New You is all about healthy choices. And we could do something like yoga as a celebration. Is my sister kidding me right now? Like, seriously? Yoga? No, girl. You earned this. We're going for an ice cream. Well, they do have the frozen yogurt option, so I guess it's okay. Uh, Daisy Life is about balance. Sometimes that balance means eating ice cream. Don't be such an income poop. 
Molly! I'm just saying, sometimes you just really need to have an ice cream. And girl, you need one. Welcome to Sweet Tooth. What can I get for you? I have a scoop of everything. Molly, new you, new you. You mean new year, new you? Yeah, whatever. Get one scoop, Molly. Wow, who knew you were so bossy? Well, I am a health guru now. TikTok even said so. Oh my God. It's Molly and Daisy. Oh my God, I can't believe it. I'm such a huge fan. I have to go say hi to them. Did you just hear that? I think that girl knows who we are. Nah, it must be a different Molly and Daisy. We're not that famous. Hey guys, it's Sarah. Welcome to my TikTok. And I'm here with Molly and Daisy. And hey, we didn't agree to be on your TikTok. Molly, come on. She's a fan. Don't be rude. Okay, well, she should have asked permission first. I, 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 I don't even look my best. Molly, you always look like that. Okay, but all right. She has a point. OMG, I can't believe it. This is amazing. What? You guys are famous and you're here at my at my ice cream shop? Woohoo, woohoo, woohoo. Um, yeah, we really are that famous, Daisy. Yeah, I realized that. Aren't you excited? New Year, New You on TikTok is doing amazing. It's blowing up. But Molly, everybody knows who we are everywhere now. Can I get your autograph? Yeah, me too. And I want a picture. And can you be in my YouTube video? And and also, can you come home and um just like sign my cat? How am I gonna sign your cat? Oh, it's it's a cat that doesn't have any fur, so you could use a sharpie. No, I'm not gonna sign the cat. Hi, yi yi. I just want my ice cream, and and I want to just go sit down. Daisy, are you okay? You seem like you're freaking out about being a celebrity. Because Molly, I am. But you wanted New Year, New You on TikTok. Yeah, but now that I got fame, I want to give it back. Come on, Molly. Let's just go home and hide out. Good idea if you don't want to be famous, which I kind of do. No, Molly, I'm telling you. I can always see into the future. Wait, you can't? Are you some sort of, like, magical human or something? No, I'm just really smart. And this, this isn't going to go well at all. Well, if you say so... I think being famous is amazing. Finally, home sweet home. No people talking about how famous we are or anything. Yeah, but seriously, don't you want to be famous? I don't know, Molly. Seems kind of crazy to just go places and everybody recognizes you. What if I had ice cream on my face during that girl's TikTok? Oh, you could be like me and don't care. I'm eating a donut right now. And I don't really care if anybody sees. Hi, um, I didn't get a picture with you guys, and so I followed you home. What? You can't follow us home. That's wrong and rude. <laughs> ha, ha, achoo! Ew, Molly, cover your nose. Sorry, I wasn't expecting to sneeze. Achoo! Molly, did you get sick? I don't know, maybe that fan had a cold, and she got super close to me and gave it to me. Ew, germs! Well, I think you better get used to it, because it seems like we're going to be mobbed by fans... From here on out, we need a security camera. And maybe a fence. Whoa. What's that? Uh-oh. Oh, my God. It's someone who looks just like me because they saw my videos about how to do pigtails. Hey, I love you. I want to be just like you. <laughs> oh, my God. That's hot shoe. Creepy. Ugh. One of the fans definitely got me sick. I don't feel so good. Ugh. Molly, do you want a donut? Maybe to make you feel better. No, I don't want a donut. Now I have to go to the bathroom. Oh, that sounds so gross. Uh oh. Whoa, she really is sick. If going to eat a donut's gonna make her throw up. Ugh. Did you see that TikTok where Molly was like, "Don't work out, just like hang out and eat on the couch <laughs> and shove your face full of donuts." Yeah, I totally loved that one. It was hilarious. <laughs> we could be BFFs since we're such Molly and Daisy fans. I don't feel so good. Am I drooling? I don't know. I'm too busy over here vegging on the couch. Uh, 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 who got us sick? They aren't super fans. They're terrible fans. Hello, this is Bruce Springer for Action News. Today I have a breaking story. The new famous TikTokers, Molly and Daisy, are very sick. 
If you like reality TV, you're gonna love this one. Watch him puke! Watch him sneeze snot everywhere! Watch him run to the potty! Are you serious? Get out of our house! This one's obviously rude in real life. I don't know if you should like her. Oh, uh, maybe unsubscribe. What? Don't tell people that! Rude! Get out! Molly, there's only one thing left to do. Run! I don't know if I can run. I gotta go potty! Oh, hello, adoring fans! It's me, Bruce Springer! Get out of the way, Bruce! I just want to be your friend! Come back, Molly! Come on! We could be BFFs! Get away from me, crazy daisy wannabe! <laughs> ah, ah, ah. Come on! I could build a house right next door to you! It would be so much fun, right? No! Stay away from me! Hurry, Molly! Come down here! Into my science lab! Okay, I wasn't going to tell you about this, but I've been working on a new project. Is it quitting TikTok? Well, no. I mean, we're already famous at TikTok. Kind of hard to go back now, but I have a solution. Well, I hope it's a good one! Ha! Ha! Choo! Because I don't feel good, and I don't want Bruce Springer, like, putting me on the news when I'm sick! Achoo! Come here, Marley. I want to show you something. What is that? A giant person made out of jello? Sort of, Molly. I haven't quite finished programming it yet. But in a moment's time, you'll see what I'm up to. Well, I don't know, Daisy. This seems a little like weird science to me. Uh, Daisy, I think you're cooking your jello, man. Don't worry, Molly, that th this is going to work. It just has to. Holy macaroni and cheese! It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, a clone! That's right, Molly. And I'm making one for you, too. Which means next time, when someone thinks it's us, it won't be us at all. It'll be our clone. Watch this. Hey, Daisy Clone. Hey, I just want to let you know, you guys are the best fans in the whole world. See? Daisy Clone is amazing. I had to sit down for a minute. I'm a little lightheaded about how awesome I am to design this. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, it's Daisy. Hi, hi. I'm your biggest fan. I'm even wearing Daisy pants because, you know, your name is Daisy, just like the flower. And oh my God, where's Molly? Hi, you're the nicest fans in the world. I love you. Whoa, she said she loved us. Did you hear that? I totally did. Oh my God, that's amazing. So, um, will you sign an autograph? Sure, I'll sign an autograph. You're the most amazing fans in the world. I love you. Holy guacamole! The Daisy clone is working! Now we just need a clone of me, and it's all smooth sailing. <laughs> Mistaken. Today's spring break. Molly, spring break is until next week. You have school for a whole nother week. What? Oh, Mom! Look at my face right now! Do I look like I can get up for school? Oh, it needs to be spring break. I can't go to school anymore. It's too much, Mom. Everybody deserves a break. Molly, seriously, get out of bed. Ay, ay, ay. Come down for some oatmeal with blueberries in five minutes. Okay, Mom. Ugh, these girls. Now, is Daisy oversleeping too? <sighs> Daisy, are you sick? Yes, yeah, sick of school. Wait, what? You're sick of school? You're never sick of school. What's going on? I just needed to be spring break. After the science fail, I'm just... All schooled out. I need a break. Even I need a break sometimes from all the work. Well, sorry, sweetie, but you still have a whole nother week of school to go. Ow. I can't do it, Mom. That's exactly what Molly said. I think she might be wearing off on you, but too bad. Meet me downstairs in five minutes for some oatmeal with blueberries. Oh, you made oatmeal with blueberries? My favorite. <sighs> if I could just get myself out of bed. Ugh, even look like you need to take a break from school. Well, Mom said we still have to go to school today, but I'm going to do the least amount of work possible until spring break. Because seriously, I need the break. Cheers, Mom!
my bright and shiny daughter. Yeah, I'm here, Mom. Ugh, I have a whole other week of school. I can't believe it. Well, it's not going to be that bad. I promise. Yeah, that's what you say. You don't even actually have to go to school. Well, that was good old man, Mom. But I gotta run to school before I play. We'll take the rest with you, Molly. And don't forget to bring, bring back the bowl. I won't, Mom. Bye. Love you. Bye, Molly. There you are, sleepyhead. You better get off to school. Your sister's already left. And Molly never leaves for school before you. Yeah, what's gotten into you, Daisy? I just need a break from school, that's all. You guys get sick days and personal days from work. Well, we kids need a break every now and again, too. Oh, look at the time. Bye! Bye, Daisy. Have a great day. Oh, you sat on the couch. That's the wrong way to school. It's this game! It always wants me to sit down! <laughs> yeah, it does glitch sometimes. Well, honey, they don't even know how hard they're going to have it as grown-ups. <laughs> Silly kids. Yeah, but let them be kids while they're still kids. There's enough time to be grown-ups in the future. Totally. Well, I gotta get to work. Oh. Yeah. Love you too, honey. Bye. Such a long walk. Uh oh wait, is that Daisy? Daisy, wait! I'm walking! Sorry, Molly, I already made the time. Daisy, you ran a red light and didn't pick me up. Oh, my sister sometimes is so rude. I wondered when you were gonna show up, Molly. You, you could have picked me up. Yep, I could have, but I just needed the peace and solitude away from my sister for a change. Ugh, sisters! Good morning, class. Good morning. I want to get started right away working on the talent show um, song that we're preparing. So, did everyone practice? Um, uh, Molly, I hope you practiced considering you were the lead singer. <gasps> yeah, Molly, don't let us down. Like, you're the in charge of the entire school band. Uh, no pressure or anything. I practiced my part, even though I'm so ready for spring break. Of course you did, Daisy. All right, guys, let's get started. Oh, okay, Molly, you missed your cues. Stop, stop, stop the music. Dad, you. God, she's terrible. We're gonna totally bomb at the talent show. Molly, 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 did you practice at all? And what does your shirt say? No homework? <laughs> well, uh, yeah, exactly. Why don't you go to the principal's office? You've let down the entire band by not practicing. If you continue to not do your homework, you're gonna fail this class and probably all of them. Uh, no, I don't need to go to the principal. Uh, let me try it again. Let me give you some advice if you meet this weird guy. <laughs> Holy guacamole, she's terrible. Ow. Okay, Daisy, okay. No need to say anything rude. We'll just have Molly go because she did not do her homework and she knows three no homeworks in a row means going to the principal's office. No, I'm sick of Molly just making our band sound terrible. This school talent show is important to our class. Molly, you stink. Yeah. Oh, Daisy, this breaks my heart to say this, but you know our no mean words policy here. It's number five on our policy paper. You had it text to you, emailed to you, printed out to you at the beginning of the year. No mean words towards other students. You have to go to the principal. What? I don't go to the principal, no, 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 unless they're having me come in there for, like, an award or something. Well, today you're going for a totally different reason. Sorry, Daisy. What? No! <laughs> Molly, this is all your fault. I can't believe it. Um, oops. Molly, I'm at the principal's office and he's weird. But no, he's not. He's totally cool, right? Go, Molly. His eyes... They look like weird and strict. Um, that's because he's the principal. He's supposed to be strict. He has to make sure all the students behave and everybody gets along. Oh boy, this isn't gonna be good. I can feel it in my bones. Come on, Daisy, don't be afraid. Well, 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 who do we have here? Oh, it's Molly, again. And who is this? Uh, yeah, I was in here last year for the gifted program. Uh, you gave me that award, remember? 
Yeah, it's my sister. She's in big trouble for being mean. <gasps> what? Mean? Okay, that's it. I have to do it. I'm calling your parents. What? No, that's a little harsh. That's a little strict, don't you think? Yeah, our parents don't need to know about this. I'm afraid they do. I will begin calling your parents now. What? See, I told you. Who says that? I will begin calling your parents now. I mean, who doesn't just call them? He's so weird and strict. Yeah, and he's about to call mom and dad. Hi. Hello? Who is this? Hello. This is the principal. I just called you. Uh, yeah, she realizes that you're on the phone with her. He's so weird and strict. You are and your husband are going to need to come down to the school immediately. Why? Are my girls okay? Is everything all right? Well, yes, they're not hurt, but they are being troublemakers. Uh -oh. Please come to the school right away and bring your husband. Um, okay. Wait, is it just Molly or also Daisy? Both of your daughters. Wait, Daisy? Daisy got in trouble? Well, I guess they believe I could get in trouble, Daisy, but not you. Of course they do. Also, your daughter is wearing an anti-homework shirt. She's not allowed at school. Oh, I didn't see her go out of the house with that. I'm so sorry. Okay, um, I'll be right there with my husband. Thank you. Okay, girls, you can go ahead and just stand over there. I'll just sit here. It's going to be a little bit of a wait. I'm going to stand here nervously. I've got butterflies in my stomach. Uh, my stomach. Uh -oh. It hurts so bad. Oh. I can't believe our girls dragged us out of, out of work for this. I can't believe Daisy got in trouble. I mean, I expect that from Molly. She's in detention a lot, but Daisy? You may leave. I want to talk to your parents. Oh, is it just me or is he getting weirder and stricter by the moment? Something's not right about our principal, that's for sure. I'm putting this on Snapchat. Okay. You are now in my house with my rules. Uh, I thought we were at the school. Yeah, I thought we were at the school. No, the school is my domain. <laughs> and your daughters need Discipline. Discipline? Who is this guy? Ay, ay, ay. Molly, where'd you go? Molly! She's probably hiding in the bathroom. That's always where she hides when she's about to get in trouble. Today, Molly wore an anti-homework shirt to school. What? I, I didn't know. I'm sorry. Um, don't worry. I'm a police officer, so my daughter will behave because, you know, we, we run a pretty tight ship at my house. We're pretty strict. Well, honey, not that strict. You need to get stricter. A lot stricter. <gasps> Daisy, what are you doing? Well, Molly, I was Snapchatting because the principal is just seeming kind of weirdo and stricter and crazy. Where have you been? I had to go to the bathroom. <laughs> I can't the thought of having mom and dad coming down to the school and hearing how naughty I am every day. Um, just made my tummy a little upset. Yeah, exactly. Mine too. Oh, it looks like mom and dad are coming out of the meeting. Hopefully we don't get grounded for life. Dad! Oh, it's so good to see you. Uh, what are you doing here during the day? You know exactly why I'm here. Girls, go get in the car. Uh-oh! Oh, is it just me or does mom and dad look kind of well? Do we look stricter? Because we're about to be. Uh-oh! Molly, Daisy, go inside. You're going to have lots of chores to do. Let's get strict. Well, at least I got out of school early. This is not so bad. What are you doing? Um, sitting down, waiting for instructions, of course. You look it up and start on a giant list of chores. Uh-oh. Starting with a whole new wardrobe. What? No, I like my no-homework shirt. Not allowed at school. Your mother has put out some new outfits for you upstairs. <laughs> Go and get changed, right? Um, anybody else notice my parents are getting kind of weird and strict? I think we need to Snapchat this. Uh, everybody, look at my parents. They're being weird and strict. No both. Uh, okay. I'll go 
go up and change. I hope it's a really cute outfit. I like unicorns! My mom couldn't possibly mean this shirt or these clothes that she left out for me. Th there's no way! What? What am I wearing? Well, you wanted to wear something weird, so I decided to give you something weird. Mom, I'm not wearing this out of the house. I look ridiculous! What? You're not a Weird Al fan? Uh, well, yeah, but, you know, having a close-up of his face is a little crazy. Well, I think it's awesome. Mom, no, please! Fine. I picked out some other things I think you'll really like. Try them on. Oh, my mom really has gone weird! I don't really know what's going on with my mom right now, but ever since she met with the principal, some crazy things have been happening, and she's decided that she's going to change my outfits. She just thinks that, like, they're not right or something for school, and, oh, look at that one. I made that myself. I can tell because it's weird. What? Did you just call my shirt weird? Well, if the shoe fits, wear it, princess. <gasps> I can't believe it. I spent so long making that. Mom, we've been home for like five minutes. It looks like you cut it out of some construction paper or that you printed it off on the printer and like badly cut it out. Meow. I think it's adorable. You know what? Since you don't appreciate my things that I do for you, I have the perfect outfit. Uh, no, I think I'll pass. Pass! You don't get a choice. I'm the mom. Now put it on. Oh, no. The meowing cats weren't bad, and the weird owl wasn't bad. This one is going to be bad. I just know it. Oh, my God. My mom has dressed me like a noob. It says my oof on my shirt. I don't like this one. I'm not wearing Ooh. it. You will wear it because I said so. Now, time to do some chores. Oh, I don't like chores. Well, you like them now. Um, okay. Ow! I promise I'd never get to go to the principal level again. I have be good. No, too late for that. Now mow the lawn. Uh, we don't have any grass. What time am I supposed to mow? Find some grass and mow it. Um, okay, I'll mow the grass. Holy quackaboli. These kids are such brats. That's so weird. There's a doghouse in our backyard. We don't even have a dog. <laughs> Meanwhile, I'm outside mowing bricks. Tell me you're just standing around not doing any chores. What chores? I see that Daisy's mowing the patio for some reason, and I think you guys are just making up chores that don't even exist. <gasps> oh, really? I want you to serve some dog food for the dogs. Mom, we don't own any dogs. Do as I say. Okay, fine. I don't even have dogs. Guys, I don't know what's going on with my parents. They're being insane. And they just, like, my dad just had Daisy mow the grass, but there is no grass. And my mom is telling me to get dog food served for our dogs. Except for, we don't even own dogs. I don't know what she's talking about. Well, surprisingly, we actually had dog food. So I guess I'll go out back and feed the dogs. How you doing mowing that non-existent grass? Oh, it's a lot of work, Molly, but, you know, I'm handling it. What do you got dog food for? I'm going to feed our dogs. Molly, we don't have a dog, but all of a sudden there's a dog, a dog house in our backyard. I don't even understand. I don't either. Where's these dogs I'm supposed to be feeding? There you are. Come in here, girls. Um, I didn't feed the dogs yet because I didn't know where to feed them. Set that down on the table, please. Um, okay. Do the, do the dogs eat at the table? They sure do. Molly, our parents have gone all weird and strict. Shh, here comes Mom. Oh, perfect. You set it on the table. Now go ahead and sit down and eat. Wait, what? I thought this was for the dogs. Uh-oh. Oh, you girls are going to have dog food surprise for dinner. What? Nah, that's where I draw the line. Oh, really? Sounds like these girls need to be grounded for life. Agreed. No dinner for either of you. I uh, know. I'm really hungry. I'll take the dog food surprise. Nope. To bed. What? Ugh. What is wrong with my parents? They've gone crazy. I didn't even get to eat my dog food snack. Now I'm feeling really sad. This is all your fault, Molly. You're the one that, 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 that got us in trouble in the first place. Well, I didn't break.
break the rule in school. That would be all you. Oh, yeah, yeah, Molly. What are we going to do? First of all, we're going to Snapchat about this in case someone um needs to see this. Like, they'll see it, and then maybe they'll come rescue us. Come on. Come behind me, Daisy. Okay, there we go. Hey, guys. It's Molly and Daisy, and our parents have gone weird and strict. And we definitely need some help over here. Um, So try to find us if you can, okay? Uh, um, Because, uh, Molly, just give them a, a dress. We're not supposed to give our dress out on the internet. Oh, yeah! Just find us if you can, because our parents have gone weird and stupid. Okay, I'm sending the story to everybody at school. Someone will come rescue us. Molly, I hear Mom and Dad. Quick, put away your phone! Get into bed! Pretend you're sleeping! Okay, Molly, I'm, I'm gonna pretend. Close your eyes if you're pretending. What's this? Two sleeping girls? I guess I don't have to give them another punishment. Yeah, but punishing them is fun. <laughs> Told you they were weird and sweet. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Hi guys, so what's up? Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Guys, today we're playing good or bad, Abby. And everybody knows where Molly's gonna be. I'm gonna be a perfect little angel. Sure you are, Molly, sure. I think one of us should be an angel and one of us should be a demon. Um, well then you should obviously be the demon. <laughs> Molly, you're the one that gets attention all the time. You have to be the demon. Okay, fine. I'm the demon. <gasps> and I'm a beautiful angel. I'm a beautiful angel, huh? Molly, quit being so rude. No, I don't have to be. I'm a demon, so I can be as rude as I want. <laughs> All right, um, you can be good or bad on this level, it says. But you cannot go on the angel side if you're a demon. And you cannot go on the demon side if you're an angel. Mm. So this Abby is definitely different, guys. If you think it's cool, slam that like button. So here I am, guys, on the demon side because my sister made me choose to be a demon. Yeah. Molly, you're a demon all on your own. I'm beating her right now. Yeah, because you're a cheater, cheater, pumpkin, demon. <gasps> person. What? No, I'm not. Because cheater, cheater, pumpkin eater. Yes, but you're a cheater, cheater because you're a demon. Bum, 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 ba -da -ba -da bum, 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 bum. So if I try to go on the light side over here, it lets me. Seriously? Oh no, I died. <laughs> you can buy a can't die immunity though, but I don't know why you do that and play an obby. Like, that's not very fun. I'm already at stage eight. I'm beating Daisy so horribly right now because I am so much better at being a demon than she is at being an angel. Maybe she's really a demon. <laughs> she just doesn't want to admit it to herself. Whatever, Molly. I'm right behind you, by the way. Uh-oh. Let me see. Oh, my God. She is right behind me, guys. Gotta hurry. I gotta hurry. Gotta use these demon wings to kiss farther ahead than her. That was a terrible demon song. Yeah, I gotta work on my demon delivery here. Like, seriously, that was, that was not a good song. I'll even admit it. Wait, what's this? I, oh, I have to, I get to go around? Is that what it is? Oh, and then I get a ladder. Cool. All right, let's see who beats the other person at this part, Daisy. It's gonna be me, cause I'm an angel. Oh, it was like a tie, Daisy. But now I am beating you. I am a cute little demon. Well, you can't be a cute little demon. Demons are evil. Look at me, guys. Do you think I'm cute? Ah! I just died. Oh, my God. I didn't mean to die there. Do you guys think I'm a cute demon? Slam the like button if you think I am. I think I'm adorable. Boing, boing, boing. Ha <laughs> ha, see you later. The good in the light always wins, Molly. We'll see about that. <laughs> ah, if I don't die. Which is seeming pretty hard not to. Holy guacamole. Ah, 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 what? Oh, I can't go down those stairs. It tricked me. So many stairs. So many stairs. Oh, Daisy died too. Whatever, Molly. I didn't mean to. Oh, you never do, Daisy. You never do. All right, guys. We're about a quarter of the way through this obby. Look, you can pay to finish the obby. 
I just want to see how much that is. Because, like, why would you pay money to finish the sobby? 500 Robux, guys, to cheat and go all the way to the end. You should definitely buy it, Molly. I would, but there's some giant, amazing donuts right here. Oh, they're so good. Buddy, don't you eat too many. You get a stomach ache. Ow. Listen to this angel over here. Don't eat too many donuts. Good thing I'm a demon. I can do whatever I want, and I want to eat all these donuts. Okay, suit yourself. Get a stomach ache. Get a stomach ache, man. You're annoying. <laughs> you said something mean. You're not an angel after all. <laughs> <laughs> whatever, Molly. I tried to be nice to you, but you're just so... What? Demony? <laughs> Alright, this is like an old school obby, like before like Packstabber and all those guys came out with a super awesome obbies where it was like you're actually playing a story. These are just like kind of run of the mill obbies, but what is that? It's like I went through like a giant thing of trash. But it's cool because you get to be either be an angel or a demon. That's what makes this obby so cool. Wow. My sister is a nagging angel. You ever hear one of those? Uh-oh. <laughs> Whatever. I'm just trying to do the most good, Molly. I bet. I bet, Daisy. All right. I think these are disappearing stairs, guys. Look, they, they match my body and my wings. That is so awesome. Guys, if you would play this obby, slam that like button. I think it's pretty cool, and we're halfway through. Stage 29, guys, and we've only been playing for, like, five minutes. So, I think that's amazing, guys, don't you? I think that's so amazing. What just happened? Look, at, I have, like, an evil little face, too. All right, I think this one, next one is, like, a tricksy one. All right, there we go made it giant slices of pizza mm. even after you ate all of those donuts let me use a sin molly what i want to eat all the donuts and pizza i love them if eating donuts and pizza is wrong i don't want to be right all right um let's go through these glass walls and see if i can not die oh i was doing so good and then i died at the end here then here then here then here. Bum, ba, da, da. Oh, this is like this is like a roller coaster without the cart. <laughs> I ate so much pizza right now, guys. It was delicious. I'm not even gonna lie. I ate pizza in real life today too. Oh, it was so good. It had pepperoni and cheese. My two favorite things. What do you? Oh my gosh! I was thinking about pizza and then I died. What's your favorite thing to eat on a pizza, guys? Let me know in the comment section below. Do you like anchovies? What? Do you really, guys? Don't lie. Do you like pineapples? Maybe you're from California. I know they eat um, pineapple on their pizza there. I know because I took, took a trip to California once to this place called Carmel by the Sea, and I got pizza there. By the way, it was beautiful there. Um, But yeah, you have to be like... Uh, mega, 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 mega rich to live there permanently. So I just, I visited. And we went to a pizza shop. And guess what, guys? Um, mm. all of their pizza pretty much had, um, pineapple. And I was like, um, I don't eat pineapple on my pizza. And they were like, what? Get out! Just kidding. They didn't tell me to get out. But they were like, well, I guess we could take the pineapple off the pizza for you. But why? Why would you do something so awful to your pizza? I'm like, um... I'm from the east, and we don't eat pineapple on our pizza here. We just eat pepperoni. They're like, ew, pepperoni, gross! <laughs> well, Molly, this was a crazy story. You're getting very far behind on this abbey. Well, it was a very important one to tell people. Whoa, 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 this is trying to make me slide off and die. Uh oh That's not very nice. The demon will curse you. Just remember that. Oh, my God, there are lava squares here definitely not nice you can be good or bad on this level i'm just gonna be me molly sometimes good sometimes have these little demon horns but always me never give up and never surrender you can do anything never give up and never surrender i am a demon that's not how it goes molly for today it is because i'm playing this demon obby it's a good or evil, Abby, not just a demon, Abby. 
Well, I'm the one that's making this video. So I say it's a demon Abby. Oh, how do I even live with her as a sister? Boing, boing. Guys, I wondered the same thing. So I thought about moving out and I made a video about it. If you guys want to watch it, it's on my best friend Brookie Baby's channel, Gaming with Brookie. And um, I think you guys will think it's pretty cool. Yeah, did you like living by yourself, Molly? Today, I'm thinking it'd be a good idea, Daisy. I'm thinking it would be a good idea. Me too. See you. Uh oh Oh my gosh. I'm jumping on pitchforks. Daisy is jumping on clouds. All right, that's pretty cute. <laughs> Boing. All right, where's my level? You can be good or bad on this level, Molly. Okay, good. Whew. I only died a few times. That was pretty good. Oh, this ladder's gonna be forever, isn't it? We're going to the top of the noob. Then what? Then we're about to win, Molly! Wee! <laughs> that slide was fun. I wanna play as uh, an angel next time. Uh-huh. You probably won't even be allowed. What? Why? Because you're so naughty. They're going to be like, nope, you're kicked out of the game. <laughs> All right, guys. Um, Look at When I go for the black, you can't even see my horns. They might not be able to see them, but we all know it's Tokyo Mahali. Um, where is Daisy going? Going up to the sky with all the other angels. Guess where you're going? <laughs> Detention? Something like that, Molly. Something like that. Uh, guys, I don't like where this is heading. This seems like bad. I just keep going down all these stairs. More stairs, more stairs. Uh-oh. One eternity later. Uh-oh. Well, I made it to the end. Even though I had to go down, 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 down where the demons live. <laughs> all right, guys. Where's my sister? I need heaven. Oh my gosh, where'd you get those balloons? I want them. Only angels get them. <laughs> Whoa, that's so rude. Uh oh, she's getting angry. Watch out for demon money. <laughs> Wait, what? They're a demon and an angel? I'm so confused right now. <laughs> Hush, hush now, little Ember. Shh, shh, shh. Everything's going to be fine. How is everything going to be fine? We're abandoning our baby! It's the right thing to do. Uh, they'll never understand. But, but she's our baby! <laughs> wee, wee. Shh, shh, shh. Ember, everything's going to be fine. You'll see. Your new family will love you so much. I get your word with your budget up. That's right, baby. You be a good girl now for your new mommy and daddy. And just know, your mother and I will never, ever forget you. Be ready to run, honey. I I'm about to ring the doorbell. I can't leave her. We have to. We have to. Okay, I rang the doorbell. Run! She'll have a better life, honey. I promise. I hope you're right. I miss my baby already. Oh my gosh, I'm actually on time today. Congratulations, this is the first time in history that you're not gonna get detention. <laughs> oh, very funny. You think that my achievements aren't amazing, but I think they're really amazing. Yay, Molly, you're not getting detention. You're doing what you're supposed to. Daisy, why are you so in my face right now? Oh, sorry, I was just a little too close, but I wanted you to hear me clapping and, and, and applauding for how amazing you are for just being a mediocre student. Hey, I think I'm a pretty good student. I mean, I showed up today. Isn't that enough? Ay, 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 Molly. Good morning, class. Good morning. Everybody, please take your seats. Whoa, Molly, you're on time. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. All right, take your seats, everyone. I have an announcement. New student today. I want you to all be very kind when she comes in. And, you know, if you wanted to be her friend, ask her to sit with you at lunch. That would be so nice of you. I bet the new student is a total loser. Um, Sarah, that's not very nice. Everyone, say hello to Ember. Ember? What kind of weird name is that? Well, I think it's a very cool name, Sarah. Quit teasing her, Jeepers. She just got in the classroom. Hi, everyone. I'm Ember. Um, this is a new school for me, so I'm, like, a little nervous because I don't have any friends here or anything. But I hope that I could be friends with you guys, if that's cool. 
Yeah, we'll be friends with you. Her face and her makeup are like really weird. Uh, Sarah, I would like you to go see the principal now. What? What did I do? You're being very rude to the new student. Sorry about that, Ember. No, it's okay. I'm used to it. I've started over at like five new schools now. Five new schools? Wow, you move around a lot. Are your parents in the military or something? No, <laughs> it just never really works out for me at any of my schools. Oh, well, um, I'm Molly, by the way, and this is my annoying sister, Daisy. I'm not annoying, don't listen to her. Well, hi, Molly and Daisy. Our best friend, um, Brookie Cookie's not here today because she has a stomach flu, and basically she's sitting on the toilet all day. At least that's what she told me. Molly, are you sure that Pookie would want you to say that? Hey, it's the truth. <laughs> oh, sorry about your friend. Uh, would you like to sit with us at lunch, Ember? Sure, that would be great. Thanks so much. What can I get for you? Oh, hey, Large Marge. Um, let's see, you got any tater tots today? No, I'm about to cut this garlic bread. Oh, is that why you got a knife in your teeth? That's kind of creepy. How else do you think I'm going to cut the garlic bread? Um, I don't know, but I'll take a piece of the garlic bread. Great, fine. Awesome. Ember, don't worry about it. Our lunch lady, Large Marge, is a little bit crazy, but she's a good cook. Except for when she makes sauerkraut sandwiches. Ew, why would she make sauerkraut sandwiches? I don't know, ask her. Uh, no thanks. <laughs> she might give me one. and I don't want a sauerkraut sandwich. But I would like some Tabasco sauce. Do you have any ghost peppers and jalapenos? Holy guacamole, Ember. Now I know why you have your name, Ember. All that stuff sounds super spicy. I love fiery foods. It's my favorite. Daisy, aren't you going to eat school lunch? Absolutely not. That stuff will clog your arteries quick. Tato tots. Ay, ay, ay. I need to live forever so I can make the most amazing science discovery. Don't mind my sister. Like I said, annoying. Oh, very funny, Molly. So, Ember, what do your parents do for a living? Oh, um... Well, first of all, I guess I should say I'm adopted. What? That's so cool! Yeah, I don't really know who my real parents are. I was left on the doorstep of a, as a baby at my adopted parents' house. Say what? Just, just abandoned there? As a sweet little baby? Are you serious right now? Yeah, but my adoptive parents are super cool. They're a little strict though, but you know, it's okay. Do you ever wonder why or how your parents just like uh, left you there? I wonder about it all the time. Did they leave a note? Yeah, they just said, this is our little girl, Ember. We can't keep her. Please take super good care of her. Wow, that is amazing. Oh boy, here comes Sarah. Ugh, look, it's the new loser student who's got a weird face and a weird name and everything's weird about her. Ugh, I'm gonna post about this right now. You better not, Sarah. Don't be rude. She's a new student and she's really nice. Whatever. Ugh. Okay, I'm gonna take a selfie first because I look great today. Actually, I think she kind of looks a little grumpy, but you know, it's just me. Well, why don't we take a picture of Ember so I can show everybody how weird she is. That's not very nice. Take that back. Not a chance. Don't worry, she's just being a bully. It's what she does. I don't I don't like being bullied. Take that back. Weirdo. I'm not taking it back. You're a weirdo. Take that back! Uh Ember, are you okay? What? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm just getting really angry. Um, I think you might want to just cool it down a little bit. What is going on with your eyes? They look like they're on fire. Oh, this is weird. Yeah, take back what you said to me, bully. No, you're still a weirdo. And I think you're kind of ugly, too. Take it back. Ah! Oh, my God! Uh, somebody get some water! Ember's on fire! Okay, I just gotta look for that janitor bucket. It's around here somewhere. Got it! Just gotta fill it up with some water. Why won't the sink turn on? Okay, well, toilet water it is, you know. Beggars can't be choosers. Okay, got it. Ember! Ember, I've got some water! Everything's gonna be okay! Molly, stand back! I've got the fire extinguisher! Okay, that's that's probably better than the toilet water. Hold still, Ember! What are you guys talking about? I like being on fire! Now take back what you said to me, bully! You need to calm down, Ember! You're gonna burn the whole Brookhaven school down! Ah! Don't spray me! I don't like water! Uh, I... I'm sorry, I think I let my anger get the best of me. Um, the Sarah, I think 
you should probably leave now. Whatever, weirdos. Ugh, I knew there was some reason for me to just like, not like you guys at all. Okay, that's fine. Just go. Ember, are you okay? What happened? Um, I'm not really sure. It just, it happens at my other schools too. When I got a little mad. O-M-G. Is that why your parents keep moving you to new schools? Yeah. They don't know why I turned to fire. Wow. I think I might know. Really? Why? I'm taking notes for my science experiment when I come over to my laboratory after school. Daisy, she's not your science experiment. Well, she could be. Daisy, get your head in the game here. Um, okay, so I, I'm just asking her. Is it okay if I just like poke you with some needles and... Daisy! Okay, fine. Molly, what's your answer as to what's going on here? I think her parents Where? Elements! What? Yeah, don't worry. If we find your parents, we can get all of the answers. Well, I don't know. I mean, they're going to be really hard to find. We have no choice, Ember. We have to find them. And you have to try to control your anger. Especially when someone calls you weird. Well, I don't like being called weird. <laughs> Nobody calls me weird. Uh-oh, she's starting to smoke again. Let me get the fire extinguisher. Ember, try to control your anger. Can you do it? Think about happy things. Puppies, kittens, and, 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 um, pizza. Okay, I think I'm calming down now. Good, see? You can control it. This is good. Now, we just have to find out where your parents are so we can figure out what, what are you? Well, she's obviously the element of fire, duh. I could have told you that one. <laughs> So, Brookie, what did Luke say after you told him that? Oh, he didn't really say anything. He kind of just ran out of the room. Oh, my gosh. Daisy, why are you on my bed? Um, Brookie, I gotta go. My sister's being annoying. What? I am not, Molly. Okay, Molly, well, try not to fight too much. I love you both. You're both my best friends, and I want you guys to get along. You don't have sisters. You don't know what it's like. Daisy, why are you on my bed? Um... Because, Molly, um, I accidentally spilled water on my sheets and my bed is wet. I don't care. This is my bed. Get off of it. It's my property. Molly, I'm studying for my science test and it's very important. Besides that, Dad's downstairs running the vacuum. I can't study down there and I can't sit on a wet mattress. Ugh. Why do I have to share a room with my sister? That's it. I've had it. Mom! 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 What is it now, Molly? Oh my gosh, I'm washing these dishes. Mom, I want my own room. No, I need my own room. Well, Molly, there's only one bedroom for you and Daisy. One for baby Kira, which you don't want a room with her because she's up half the night crying and needing a diaper and a bottle and... Ah! Why can't I have my own room? I'm the oldest. You get your own room. No, correction. I have to share it with your dad, and he snores and talks in his sleep. Sometimes he even farts in his sleep. Ew, gross! Look, Molly, this is the house that your father and I can afford. Yeah, and it's great, isn't it? Even as an elevator! I never thought I'd live this amazingly. Oh, man, this house is great. Well, it doesn't seem that great to me. Why don't we buy one that has a, my own room and Daisy has her own room? Molly, you obviously don't remember what our first house was like. Yeah, Dan, she was too little. <laughs> but I remember that house like it was yesterday. Baby shark do 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 do. Baby shark do 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 do. Molly, be quiet. I can't hear Coco mowing. No, I want to sing it. Baby shark do 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 do. You're super annoying, Molly. Oh, you're super annoying. Okay, girls, that's enough fighting. Come on in the kitchen. Your mom and I are making something delicious for dinner. I kind of hungry. Me too. I'm kind of hungry too. What are we having? Oh, look, girls, it's taco night. Are you excited? i excited. Are you excited, Molly? What's wrong, Molly? Why the sour face, honey? Oh, I don't want to eat any tacos. What? Why not, honey? You love taco night. It's so much fun. You get to make your own taco, and it tastes so delicious it goes into your tummy. I don't want to put anything in my tummy. Oh, 
Oh, do you have a tummy ache? Yeah, I have a really bad tummy ache all of a sudden. I think, I think I need to go sit back down and watch Baby Shark. Oh, I think she just wants to watch Baby Shark instead of eat dinner. Um, Dan, you obviously don't know our daughter. <laughs> Her want to watch anything over eating tacos? I don't think so. She loves tacos. I really don't think she has any desire to eat dinner. She just acts like she doesn't feel good. Oh, my tummy really hurts. Oh, honey, I'm going to go get you some medicine, okay? And you can drink some Pepto-Bismol. Maybe it'll make your tummy feel better. I don't want to take medicine. I don't like medicine. Okay, honey, here's some Pepto-Bismol. I'm not taking it. I'm not taking it. Molly, come on. Be brave. Take deep breath. You can do this. Come on, Molly. You can take the medicine. It's okay. <laughs> I don't want it. I'm afraid. It's going to taste yucky. I'll give you a um, prize. Do we actually have a prize? Oh, no. I'll have to look around and see if I have a toy or something that we forgot to give her for her birthday. <laughs> Just take the medicine, honey. Your tummy really hurts. Ew, it tastes gross. I know it tastes gross. Hey, look it. Look what I've got. I took my medicine so I get that cute little monkey, right? That's right, sweetheart. Oh, here you go, honey. You can have the monkey. Thank you, Daddy. It's really cute. Oh, no. With the monkey, my tummy doesn't feel so good. Uh-oh, honey. Do you need the pukey bucket? I didn't miss the bucket. I didn't miss the bucket. I didn't miss the bucket. Uh-oh, uh, he kind of swelled up. <laughs> Oh, boy. Looks like somebody might have the stomach bug. Oh, no. If she's got the stomach bug, it means we're all going to get the stomach bug. Not me. I'm not going to get it. Oh, my God. My tongue queen. Oh, man. She must have a fever. She's got it really bad. Well, I just gave her the medicine, so hopefully some of it stayed down there before she threw up. Don't worry, Molly. Pepto-Bismol always makes me want to throw up, too. It tastes terrible. I don't feel so good. I think I'm going to throw up my taco. Ew, gross. That's so disgusting. Ugh, man. I can't even move off the couch right now. Tommy hurts so bad. Oh, my gosh. They both have the stomach bug, Laura. We're doomed. What are you wearing? I'm getting my hazmat suit and uh, my face mask and... Uh, um, uh, I need to get some hand sanitizer. Oh, honey, I think we're probably going to get the stomach bug, too. You know how that germs happen. The stomach bug is relentless. And we only have one bathroom! Ah! Wow, Mommy, I never thought we'd be so sick that we'd match the couch. I know, we're so sick we turn green. Oh, I have to try to make it to the toilet. Oh, no. Oh, I didn't make it. Oh, I gotta change my clothes again. I hope you hurry up in there, Dan. I, I need to throw up. I need to use the bathroom. I gotta go potty. Me too. Why do we have a house that only has one bathroom? Oh, no. Oh. My turn. I have to go potty next. I'm not gonna wait either. I have to go so bad. Wait, where's the potty? There it is. I forgot for a minute. It's because I'm so weak from having the stomach bug. Oh, I just, I just throw up in the shower, I guess, you know, because, <sighs> girls, can you hurry up? I need to use the potty again. I'm not done in here. <clears throat> oh, man, I think I'm going to throw up in the sink. Oh, <clears throat> are you girls almost done? I have to go to the bathroom. <clears throat> no, never mind. Too late. That's why we saved up to buy a bigger house. We needed more than one bathroom. Holy guacamole, that sounds awful. Yeah, this house was really expensive. Brookhaven is, well, very expensive to live in, and so we did the best we could. But rest assured, if you ever have to go potty because you have the stomach bug, there's more than one bathroom. <laughs> yeah, too bad there's not more than one bedroom for me and Daisy. But I'm thankful and grateful that you guys bought us such a nice house to live in. I guess I am pretty lucky. Aw, thanks for saying that, Molly. Well, I better get started on dinner. Dinner? What are we having? Are we having tacos? 
I never want to look at another taco again after that day. Me either. Love tacos. I know, but your father and I can only have tacos like once a month. Every time we think about them, it's like, oh, I'm reliving that throwing up thing all over again. Anyway, we're having nice, healthy, delicious salads. Oh, salad. Oh, no, honey, what's wrong? Are, are you getting a stomach bug again? No, I just can't stand the thought of another salad. Oh, oh I'm with Molly. I'm having a hot dog. See, dad's eating a hot dog. Well, I gotta eat salad. I don't wanna eat salad. Dan, we're setting a good example for the girls. Stop eating the hot dog. You're not the boss of me. I can eat a hot dog if I want to, unless you can catch me. Oh, wow. So grown up of him, huh? Yeah, well, you just can't make your father eat healthy. You just can't.